Captain Falcon in a roar!
Dog Battle. Dog Battle. Pokemon Trainer! It is. Gotcha. Huh. 
Enderman!
Stock battle! Mr. Game and Watch, Fox!
Stock Battle. We hit traitor. Three, 
Bajo.
Stop battle!
Stock Battle. Lucina!
Start the battle! Greninja! Whoa!
Start the battle! Stop battle! Enderman! Stop the battle! Enderman!
Estado.
Ninja Joker Battle! Reninja!
Stop Battle! Joker! Reninja!
Start the battle! Greninja!
bollocks. Zombie! And, ladies and gentlemen, we are here. How are you guys doing? Scrim Showdown number 82. I am typical. I am joined by my good friend. Scruple HD, you already know. So, uh, quick quick backstory here for me personally is that uh, uh, I'm, I'm, I got bones to pick with all the them TOs here, right? Because oh. they started streaming these locals at BGBC right as I went to college, and I'm like, what are you doing? But now that I'm back, nah, we got him back, ladies yeah. and gentlemen. We're we, here, we and we're back. jumping right in. All jokes. We're a little bit jokes. late. We're right here where we were winner semis. This yeah, is Ateta yeah. versus Deshaun, aka yeah. Kirby509, aka Cyber. <laughs> nah, yeah. Oh, it's no. Kirby509. I thought. Yeah. Okay, awesome. So we got Ness versus Olimar. Now, <laughs> truth be told, Olimar is like a, char a character that's quite frankly an enigma to me. I've, I've fought, I've fought Kirby509 a couple times. But each time, I just get hit by a Pikmin, and I'm like, oh, oh, I, I, I'm going to hit him. And then I just run into an F-Smash. I'm like, huh, truly I've been outskilled. It's an interesting kind of bullet hell, isn't it? Which is interesting in, because there's lots of bullet hell E characters uh, in this beautiful, beautiful game. Oh, yeah, um, absolutely. But, I, but yeah, you can, there's, there's many different ways you can, you can interpret it around there. Uh, we weren't here for the first set of winter semis, which was Ice Knight versus Raven King, which I believe went in the way of Raven King. <laughs> So, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Now, so now we're going into w with what we got right we're, here. Yeah, we're hopping into Ted occurred five nine Rickles and okay. Chad. Rickles and Chad heard me come on. It's to end the stream. All right. No, no, they said end the stream because I was talking trash about TOs, but it's all jokes. Mm -hmm. We we love our TOs here. No, nah, Rickles it, definitely it, said it, that about me. I love you. No, 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 no. That was, uh, whatever. But um, um, but it was. I was remembering so funny. Literally the day I went to college, I was like, oh surprise, we're on VGBC, and I'm like, bro, I can't wait to come back for summer. And now here we are, yeah, like we four are. months later. Let's get it. It's I'm good so to have you back. I'm so happy to be here, man. Yeah, man. Uh, so question: Does Magna do anything with Pikmin? I don't think so, right? Definitely not. Because it's not. It's not a. It's like it has to be Definitely like an energy, not. like projectile. Type, yeah, I exactly. Yeah. So, uh, plan is pretty pretty. Uh, Atena's plan is pretty well. Um, but um, no. But something, something else that I thought was really funny. Do you got? Do you remember that very first um, um, thing about like the E3? I believe it was like 2018 where they first talked about the game and they're like, we changed all of Mars helmet so that it cracks. Don't worry, nothing happens. And we're like, oh, then why'd you do it? Now, it's wouldn't just, it it's such a small change? Like you th wouldn't think there'd be like an interesting little thing change with it, but it, but I just saw it and I was like, oh, it made me remind that because I always thought that was really silly. But it, Olimar clearly doesn't care because he is beat. Oh my God, this is this poor child. I don't remember the purple is out. Smash Four as much was Olimar like super good in Smash Four? I think he was, but I don't remember. Do not ask me. I played I played Charizard because I like Pokemon and that was it. I, was, <laughs> I didn't know competitive. <laughs> there scene it is. I didn't know competitive scene existed until I was, I was on Ultimate Hype Train. So you know how it'd be. Kirby Five Hundred Nine doing a pretty good job, even in back up here. Got one purple Pikmin on deck here. I think he just lost. Can you get point. two more to complete the Myra Zone in the man's honor? A little scary, a little. That, that's like nightmare scenario. That's Defcon three when you hit yeah. the. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta go. Oh my lord, that drifted down because I think he hit a Pikmin, caught him, almost hit an F smash. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I feel like PK, PK fire in this matchup's gotta be pretty solid. Yeah, but like the, the Pikmin, it, it's good for killing blood Pikmin, because it can be annoying if you're trying Whoa. to actually hit the spaceman, right? And there's a Pikmin well, like you can't have it, but yeah, hey, yeah that'll do there it. There it is, that'll do it. He was I mean, making up. He was. It was like. Yeah, it was a pretty close game there. It was. And I, if I'm not mistaken, he. It was like two stocks to one. Like they were at like both zero, I think. So that was. It was pretty solid considering the uh, the, the circumstances. Yeah. Go, right. Uh, well played to both of them. Good stuff to Atata for taking game one there. Um. Yeah. No, but I think PK. I mean, because then maybe this is just me being a bad player and not knowing how to deal with it. But I feel like PK True. Fire hitting Pikmin, it just puts up kind of a wall. Yeah, know? no, so, I think you're right. Um, I mean, I don't think it affects Olimar as much, because obviously, like, he can just kind of keep his distance with Pikmin, but when you get that wall, it's going to be kind of hard to navigate around the stage. You gotta, you can use that to kind of take stage control in certain areas, I feel like. What, what, uh, did he have a Pikmin up in the platform? He was down something? Okay, wait, no, I've legit seen, like, crazy tech like that. I don't know if it's like tech, but you, you just put a Pikmin on the platform, and you can do stuff like grab them, even though Olimar himself is below the platform, and, like, wacky scenarios like that. I, I just think that's so silly. Yeah. I was I was a huge Olimar hater in, like, early 2019, Ooh. where there were Olimars everywhere, but now because, like, people aren't getting the same results, all of a sudden he's cooler to me. It's crazy how that works. <laughs> 
So now now he's just a silly little guy, and now I like when that when those wacky things happen. And let's be honest, we all got that kind of bias in us, us right, guys? It's not just me, right? Maybe, it's bro. It's not just me. Yeah, right? I, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I, I think Olimar is just like a very, like, I, I feel like every fighting game's kind of got a character like Olimar, where it's just like that niche little weird character that's got like kind of crazy depth under the surface, but is just like, is going to be annoying to fight. Sure. But is definitely a really good character if you put in the time to learn all the little niche mechanics yeah. of it. All of a sudden, I have the sudden urge to do a really, oh, okay, well, first of all, that happened. But I have a sudden urge to, to develop a really annoying commentator habit of just whistling whenever Olimar whistles, just so we can keep track of how many times he does it. Dude, because I, whenever <laughs> he gets out of his stun like that, I'm just like, all right, buddy, you got away with that The one. fact that the whistle has armor like that is so ridiculous. Has it always has it been like that since Brawl? No, surely not, right? Production Man says yes, I trust Production what? Man. Really? I trust Production All Man. All right, Production Man says yes. When, it, when in doubt, trust your production team. They probably know more than the commentator anyways. No. <laughs> you gotta get, get over here now. We need you on camera. Pro <laughs> Production man, they, they they know more than us. We just we just we, we just like act like we, we know just what's like going either we're on we're, the we're, debate team or we're like two two one two like that. Like. We're the two two one two guys. We don't know what we're doing in this game. <laughs> Come on now. Uh, Expect so us to know so what we're doing. Nah. We're, but all right, he's pretty uh, even game here. Flying out of the zone. Oh, his helmet got cracked. How cute. That doesn't matter. <laughs> I know. Um, back at the. Midwest Invitational number yeah. five. Whenever Peach was on stream and she, uh, Peach got a uh, Mr. Saturn, every time I'd hit, I'd do the same thing you do with the whistle. I'd just go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I s silly little things like that. It's just because like, how many quote unquote silly little things can you get with an 80 ca 86 cast roster, right? It's just yeah, right. It, it's just funny to be traded. But as, then you Ooh, can also be traded oh, with the leg strap with like simultaneous coming. two PK fire. Perfect, exact same percent. Glad there's not a fire nine. around or smoky. The bear be pissed, man. That's that's a uh, that was <laughs> that was. <laughs> I haven't I haven't commented in a while. Right? My my creativity juices are flowing. Anyways, uh, let's, <laughs> let's been, see. If, he, he been keeping that smoky I, the bear one in his back pocket. He's I like, swear, this, I this is the one. I this is the one God, that will hit I, I thought of it and I'm like, please don't let me slip up. Please my don't here. miss. I would. This, this would be so Ooh. great to put on Twitter later, man. Be like, hey guys, here's my commentator carry reel. Oh, uh, gonna take it off stage there. Yep. All right. Uh, nice stuff. Up a stock here, but obviously 126%. Attata could close this out with basically any move. I feel like that's up oh, there. It is. Yeah, yeah. Just run up, jump scare, yeah. boom. Okay. Also, th th I would just like to add on Kirby 509 adding to the huge list of players that have Kirby in their tag and do not play Kirby. So, I'm pretty sure, if I'm not mistaken, the story behind that is this is. I, I, story? I, yeah, well. I use story with air quotes. Okay, yeah, no, um, yeah. If there's lore, yeah. please it, 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 I mean, his tag was cyber for a long time. Uh -huh. um, but uh, in GRV, or at least uh, down southern Illinois, there's another cyber. He uses uh, three instead of E. But okay. it was always a little confusing having two cybers. Yeah. And I don't know if that warranted the change, but I know Kirby509 was like the OG, like, 13 year old oh, tag yeah. that right. he always I'm used to I'm sure go that's with. all of the Kirby tag players oh, excuses yeah. is that it was just their 13 year old gamer tag so on Xbox. You brought it back. But he is called he is called Deshaun on Star.gg. But she told me the backstory <laughs> behind what? that too. I, I was, uh, or, uh, oh, yeah. okay. <laughs> I thought you said like the name of like a mobile game or something, and I'm like, <laughs> what? No, no, it's Star GG. Yeah, sorry. yeah. On Star GG. Right. This game got really close. Speaking of which, it, it's fun talking about the video game sometimes, right? Oh, yeah, you know? is, that, is that very what close? Uh, it has been know, neck and neck all set point, here. Double point. Double point. Oh. We got two purples and a red. Uh, basically, Pur purple about to become a perpetrator. Uh, maybe, that was maybe. a fire one. Oh, blue Pikmin! Watch oh, out for the grabs okay. there. Well, the blue Pikmin is notorious geez, for killing uh, I, with an up throw. So both of these Super characters have two things in common. One, they are short, and two, they like to survive <laughs> because neither of them are dying. Um, You're not gonna believe this. I feel like a lot of characters like to survive in this game. You really? know, it's probably bad if you look, die. You know. Dude, some people play Peach. Are you sure about that? <laughs> All right, my bad. You got. Oh, now we what? can add All Mar right. to the list. There we go. Snuck in that back air, barely. You gonna <laughs> yes, <taste> sir. <laughs> there it is. Anyways, it's had up two games to zero. But it's not like he's running away with the set, not at all. It's been very close games both I think times. if Ness kills someone with uh, his F smash, that, sh that victory screen should come up every time. So it's like, yeah, I hit a home run. You know, just like sh show off his bat. And that. It should actually only show up if that happens, I think. I don't know about Sakurai, that. Sakurai, add me to your team. I, I, know, I know better than your people. 
anyways, we're going to move on to game three. Atata with a strong 2-0 lead right now. Can he finish it to make it to the end? And yeah. I would, if I'm not mistaken, now granted, I've been out of the scene for a loop, for out of the loop for a while uh, in terms of this scene. Sure. But Atata is, I assume, seated higher. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure. So this At Atata I, is the first seed. All right, so, oh, is, is he first seed? Okay. Yeah, yeah I, you know what, I wasn't sure about who's the current, uh, O Overlord of Scrims is between yeah. Raven King and Atata, or well, even like Rodacious or any of those Atata and likewise, I believe, Kirby509. Um, both of them go to school elsewhere, so they don't come to Scrims oh, much over the summer. Ah, so or ah, much over the year, my so. people! <laughs> yeah. yes. So summer's hit, and that's speaking of um, people coming over the summer. You can see this bracket is absurd. We've got a 53. 53? Oh, 53? You, usually, usually we, we're rocking like 26, 20s, right? maybe 30s on a yeah, good day. Yeah, yeah. 53, 53 people. 53, baby. Yeah, yeah. Hey. Dude, all those people just like me, they heard that you guys are in VG boot camp, and you're like, bro, as soon as we leave, and now they came back, and yeah. they stormed the gates. And now, and now we're all here. Speaking Whoa. of which, great start from Kirby, but it's all—it's a matter Whoa. of getting the kill, right? Th all this damage literally means nothing. Yeah, you need to—you need to close this out. Blue and purple Pikmin, definitely a good combination to have here. Yeah, yeah you got—you try to get the oh. grab if you can, but if oh, double purple, one, one blue. This is this is very scary if you're on the Ooh. receiving end. Uh, okay. Tad is crawling back here though, one sixty-nine percent, but doesn't. Oh, it's had a graduated apparently. Like, yeah, Tana did. Very good by uh, by Rickles being the, the keeper of the lore here in the in the Chicago scene. Very nice, very nice. Thank you, Rickles. We, we, we bless this man's heart. We need him for that. All right, and okay, so we there did manage to steal it. Um, maybe not thrilled with taking like a decent more percent because this is definitely still very easily doable from Tata. But here, what if I just chucked a bunch of purples at you? What are you oh, going to do? It hurts, and that damage racks up so you fast. You silly goose. Oh my look lord. Look at you now. Stock deficit versus you got him off stage. Of You're gonna look to potentially oh now he's just gonna go wow, okay. Yoop, see you later. I didn't know until believe it or not, I didn't know until like a year ago that Almar flies higher when he's not holding Pikmin. I I used Ow. to wonder like why does Almar just because I don't play Almar. I was like why does he always chuck his Pikmin off stage and what is this top player doing? Clearly I know better. And I'm like oh it's because he flies higher. Yeah that makes sense doesn't it? There's some weight. <laughs> Come on, I feel I feel like that one was a gift. Okay, but you, it, you had canonically they're so tiny. I mean, like whatever really matters. So is Omar. Okay, you got me there. <laughs> you got but, yeah, I'll, I'll get. Yeah, I can't talk my uh, my, my my way out of that one. You're so right. All right. Well, um, Kirby's doing. Uh, he's still, this lead has been consistent so far. This mm -hmm. game is just. Once, once another game. How oh no! Okay, way. question. Oh. Did the Pikmin change that? Was he gonna fly there anyway? I don't know if he I, changed the direction or is, if he stalled him. Is but a, is a local Smash player slash physician? I feel I, phys I, I not feel, physician, physicist in the chat. I, I I I don't know necessarily <laughs> how it worked, but that Pikmin definitely influenced that. There's no way. It did, okay, maybe right? a little bit, but like that's just it's just it's just. No, the ledge just like wasn't there, and it just looked silly. So we'll we'll, we'll blame the Pikmin to, to make it out of um, feel better. <laughs> because we know we'll obviously be studying this and judging everything he's saying yeah. about his mess play. So you know how it is. Oh, yeah. uh, hey, that'll do it. Okay, so, I mean, obviously winnable from either side. But if I'm a Tata, I'm like I'm closing this out. I'm not letting you get the chance to adapt to me, even though I'm sure they've played yeah, many times before. But still. pretty close here. Uh, same situation. Oh, blue. blue, blue. Yeah, the blue. Yahoo! Should have known. The second you take your eyes off it. Mario's not on the screen. I don't know why I did it. Yaku. But, uh. And Blue Pikmin, sneaky as ever. Yep. All right. Was hiding behind him. No. Said, he, Boo! I actually didn't see him. Like, I had to, like, check yeah. and be like, yo, which Pikmin is it? Like, oh, is yeah. there. There's a little arrow that shows up, like, which Pikmin is in front, right? Like, I think I think that's a thing. Do you know? What? I swear to God, that's a thing where if you're with well, the three Pikmin, there's, like, a tiny little arrow that's above the lead Pikmin, so you know which one's in front. I'm not making this nah. up, right? Wait, no. what? No, I'm not making I Chat's about to prove me sorry. They're going to be like, yeah, this commentator is way smarter. He he knows all of his, his game knowledge. He's like, yeah. I'm 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 analyzing this set. Hang on. I got I got I'm, nah, you know what? I'm leaning in. I got There this. is an arrow. Boom. Like There's look, an look, arrow look where? Look. Right there. Right there. Oh, oh, the Bro. little Okay. I thought I, I, Okay. I am the most I never even know. How do I never notice that? This is like this is like the DI lines all over again. Uh, yeah, no, it is like that. Um, uh, I, like, there's another. Honestly, I I felt that also about Pikachu's uh, of the arrow. Like I didn't know that there yeah. was that as well. Like that. Like um, it's little tiny little details like that where you're not gonna notice until you unless you really uh, 
like you take note and like even I've known that there's like a little like little like a uh, little circle thing that appears when you use your double jump but I swear to god I can never see it in an actual game like my eyes are not I, I, I just never see it so some people some people are just built like that they can see all these tiny little details and it's just that kind of extra game knowledge just puts them ahead of the rest you know so that's stuff true like that. great time Ooh, Ooh, off the pick okay man. I really wasn't sure if he was gonna get there in time but the magnet hands doing, doing I feel lunch. like Kirby's been doing a really good job just slowing this game down now kind of taking it his own oh my I thought that was a free grab Maybe I'm there are golden Ooh. circles for phantom footstools okay someone's got to time you out you're clearly making them no that one's you're oh, for phantom footstools you are Man. making no surely not no I mean well maybe <laughs> I'm about to feel like well, maybe the silliest of beasts if that's uh. about to be true but yeah. All right. You know. Hey, I'll. I'll. I'll, 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 I'll don't worry, man. I'll, I'm joking. Uh, they won't let me come back here if I insult chat too much. So no. I'll, <laughs> I'll, I'll. I'll give you that one, man. I'll give you that one. Even though um, I'm gonna instantly fact check that whenever I, right. I go home. But anyways. Uh. To finally get that first stock off of Almar. He's a. Uh, get him on. No. I actually on no high key. Smart, I'll, smarter man. I'd, than us. I'd give up my my mic to this my, guy. My my he, he my brain my doing. brain ain't that big in this game. All all I know is. All, all I know is uh. Up till waft. 30% handshake. Give yourself some more credit. You can do inputs with Kazuya on a fight. Oh, stick, I'm so right? talented. You're, you, yeah, you just spend time I, in training room. It's all good. Yeah, I spent my 20 minutes in the training room so now I can beat PR players. Is all, Damn you, it. Is all you needed, baby. But uh, um, it, we're, we're looking. It's oof. looking like. Uh, I don't know. Kirby needs to get the stock. Yeah, okay, finally is. gets the stock now. Really? So at least really, really well here. He's got some room to it's play. It's kind here. of a repeat of last game, is what we're seeing here. Is yeah, the adaptation has been has been really solid. This obviously just goes to show why these best of fives are. I mean, obviously it's great if you can have him the whole bracket, but in times where this is not feasible, yeah, yeah you, it's most important to have him towards the end because these players are more likely to make these reversals. They they have, their adaptation is just oh, yeah. what sets them apart as opposed to other players. Get up attack, knocks him back off stage, looking for something. Needs to close this out. Okay, right, the this. only reason why I know about Rob's fuel tank is the fact that Sakurai said it in one of those presentations, yeah, and true. I would put those videos on repeat when I was so excited for Ultimate to come out. <laughs> the only reason why I know, I swear okay. to God. Okay, uh, last duck scenario here. Um, yep, this it's is looking It's definitely close. much more even than last game. So I it, think, I'm, okay, you know, all right, who you got right now? Who you got right now? Who I got? Well, yeah, I, I, we, I feel like we shouldn't we're be not, biased. We're not, we're not biased, it's just who you think's gonna take it in this scenario. It's not saying who I think Cyber's got some momentum, though. if I'm being honest. Or Cyber, Kirby, you yeah, know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. I, I, I think he's got some good momentum here, so we'll see. I think, all right, first, Bring I was going to say, uh, like, Atata's looking like the adaptation game is really coming in clutch. I feel like he's not going to let Kirby get another we'll one. Just, see. Ba just, just based on how this game has been progressing with the flow, like, the lead Kirby's been getting is steadily beginning smaller and smaller. Ooh. That was a good narrow. Then I, I, it was good that he went for the narrow. He didn't have the time to go for the up air, even though it probably would have been better positioning wise, or at least uh, you know, I guess for more damage. But couldn't get that either, unfortunately. Backer's gonna no Pikmin. murder the Pikmin. He's got just, no Pikmin. Just One purple. Try One purple might be only eight. Try homicide. What I don't. Whatever the word is, I don't know. What's more than whatever more of a double homicide is that? that that's what just happened. Okay. That's purple. all I'm saying. He's got a purple. I just lost the blow. Looking for some two purple. Oh, he Never was mind. like, boom! Get, the, get, that, get that purple. Got a home run into all my. Oh my goodness! Could be anyone's game. Just looking for story hits right, here. If I'm, no, it's time to grab. It's time to grab, baby. Oh, this look at child th needs to grab this. Oh, back here! That'll, that'll do it. There right. it is. His, his magical Oof. tiny little feet will do. Will do it to you, I guess. The Tedark closes it out. Clutch. Hey. Last stock scenario: three-one to FM. Yes. Good stuff. Very close games all around. That's, like that's the ad that's the seeding adaptation difference right there. He was like, I'm the higher seed. I, you're not taking. We're not going again. I five. feel like a lot of people can like look at scores like this. And I, there's been a lot of jokes I've seen on Twitter, but they see like three one. They're like, oh, he got blown back, or three zero. Oh, he got blown back. But like you look at the sets, you're like, oh my goodness. That man was fighting for his Dude, life out there, you know? Do people really look at 3-1 and be like, oh, he got destroyed? Like, I I'm feel probably. like you, you I mean, really I, I'm were fighting back. I'm, I'm exaggerating a little oh, bit. Oh, for sure. Yeah. No, yeah. But, hey, I'm just saying, if, if anyone, you know, if anyone says that, especially about high-level, top-level players, like, yeah. like, like, bro, these guys are fighting to the death. It is, at this stage in the game, it is absolutely the hardest to ever be consistent at top level. Like, obviously, it's always going to be hard no matter what, but with, with, now that there's no more patches and that everyone has like been, been playing with with these mechanics and this game's physics as opposed to other games for like for so long it's like being consistent at brackets is so much more impressive yeah. so the fact that people like spargo and akola can always be in top two no matter what is 
kind of just ridiculous. At this That's point. fair. But all right. And similar to that, how people like Ice Knight and Raven King and others, like and Atado, can consistently be here. I mean, it's it's. I mean, oh, yeah, they're great players. This is the local top level field, right? Well, I mean, so it still applies to them. And like even at local top level, like. Uh, I've been looking at Combo Breaker seeding, like Raven King is oh, yeah? the seventh seed in all of Combo Ooh. Breaker. Sir Dank, who's cool. I think I number five on the PR okay. here right now, is eighth seed, which is crazy. Who's first seed? I don't know who's all going to Combo Breaker. Um, who, uh, who is first seed? I, is East? It might going? be. It might be Riddles. Oh, Riddles is going. I didn't know that. Yeah. That, you know what? Yeah, bring the. Bring Kazuya Man over to our big fighting game tournament. Now it makes sense. True. Because uh, he also went to uh, what was that one that was? It was like last this past winter. There was also that f fighting game tournament also in Illinois. I Frosty think. Fasting? Frosty Fastings. Frosty Fastings. Yes, I remember. Yeah. And went there, so I remember that. Mm -hmm. um, he, I guess he liked the scene. He wants to come back. It's pretty cool. Um, mm -hmm. Yes, yes, Riddles, exactly. That'll be a pretty good. That'll be a pretty good bracket. It'll be very interesting. That'll be fun. I'm, I'm so excited to go. The Combo Breaker last year was my first ever major. So it's gonna be it's gonna be so cool to, to be in a place of familiarity. Um, who's up Who next? Oh yeah, obviously. Okay, yeah. We got shelter maybe ice I, night. Maybe if I uh, directed my eyes to the top of the screen, I could answer my own question. We got shelter. <laughs> so you're gonna have to help me out here because these are one of the players that I'm less familiar with. So I, it's been so long since I've been able to go to these events consistently. So so who's I don't know. About? Uh, shelter, uh, AKA as he's more formally known by all his peers, uh, the Scrim Reaper. Oh, it's, the, oh, okay. This is yeah, right, the right. one I, and only Scrim I've Reaper. I've heard the name from Twitter, but okay, so. Oh yeah. So Bayo. So the Bayonetta, the classic, okay. Scrims every okay. Monday. He's coming in, he's doing nice. his work. It's usually like him, Raven, him, Raven King, Radacious, always going back and forth and wins here. Okay, that's pretty, uh, that's but pretty Ice Knight, uh, generally more, plays more in Chicago, I believe. I don't know if he goes to many try points. I'm not. I, I really only go to scrim, so I don't know like too much outside no, of it. I know the names, obviously. <laughs> Ice Knight number two on the PR though. Very very good player, good ninja player. Definitely. I saw that. Yeah, good for him. Definitely um, a matchup. Not many people are familiar with, but uh, here at here in Illinois. We have a, quite a handful of Greninja players. So we got mm. Ice Knight, we got Mumon, we got uh, Aster. You already know. So like a lot of us have a lot of Greninja experience. But That's obviously cool Ice Knight just a little step above most of the Greninja you fight here. So it'll be interesting to see if this practice will be enough for Shelter to bring it home. It's cool for the down smash there. That's bold. Yeah, I was about to say, like, interesting, top, interesting no. get off me option. I don't know if that's, like, I, I assume it's, like, the fastest maybe of Greninja smash Ward decks, air. as, like, many yeah. smash decks tend to be. But, like, at the same time, that was, it was, it was, uh, it was, it was quirky. We can call it that. It was quirky. Quirky is when I is when is when top in my opinion when top high level players do do like very things that seem random but you're they probably had a good reason for it. Rickle said typical is a real G. That's what I've been saying, but they don't believe. Me. All right, anyway. No, no, um. I'll, I'll get that up. You are, you're, <laughs> you're a real G. Sometimes it's lowercase, but other times it's capital. No, I'm okay. Not, <laughs> I'm kidding. All right. Hey, shelter, okay. shelter closes out there. Good for him. Uh, I fairly said, even game. I only said this because he beat me with his Kazuya with a fight stick in Brock. Uh, right? That's the only reason why I think that. I, I still, I'm still upset about it. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> um, yeah, we're on. Bayonetta is doing Bayonetta things, but she, she do look flashy while she does it, so it's, yeah. not, it's not too cool. It's Bayonetta too cool. is a something. very, very interesting character in this game. I and it, oh, off oh the top, God. I did it. I was gonna say, maybe that was Di, but maybe no, it wasn't. I, I, I really, I really felt like there was a chance that Ice Knight lived there. I don't. I didn't mean to snort. It just, I, it just I, something about the frog just getting splat on the screen after <laughs> that. Just, it, oh, yeah, it, good it, it combos. my funny bone. What can I say? Bay, uh, uh, but yeah, as I was saying, Bayonetta in this game is. A very interesting case because it's not like she's incredibly broken, but she's a very tricky character. Ooh, catches a roll on the tech situation on the platform. So Good it's stuff. Like, people that say they talk, they really hate RNG in this game, and they don't think about oh, I hate Game and Watch, I hate Luigi, I hate Hero, but really I hate Greninja because that up smash works 50% of the time. So really, the fact that Ice and I managed to manage to hit that is just you know his RNG yeah. is, is, is really hit different. <laughs> nah. hit different. He caught that roll. That boy was as good as dead. I, I swear to God, I will see Grin and just catch that roll, and that move does not connect. It's like it is, I, 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 it I, feels I, like our Ice Knight's just better, clearly. Uh, <laughs> no, it's, okay. a, it's the Ice Knight difference, true. My fault. Um, oh, I, I was about to say something, but oh, oh yeah, uh, I play against Aster, the Greninja, who comes to scrims quite a bit, and I know one of the biggest pieces of advice 
Um, that you probably could have helped Shelter right there is when you're fighting Greninja, you cannot be missing those techs. You need to tech because Greninja. Lo oh, never mind. Wow. Well, all right. All right, well, Okay, question. Because did could he? I mean, I, he obviously died there, so it didn't matter. But could Shelter really not have uh, positioned better for the sweet spot for that backer, or was that like? Because cause with the with the with the witch time like really slowing um, Greninja down, I thought he could have had the time, but and maybe, maybe and just panic because he knew yeah, it was running out there. He, he I don't just know. wanted to hit, I guess. Yeah. I don't know for certain, uh, but Shelter's a uh, smarter man than us, so maybe Me, we'll both the average ones who were critiquing the players in top eight. It's true. Actually, I think he could. Yeah, I actually he could have positioned the, the sweet spot back here a little bit more, I think. But you know. Coco said getting Smash Four vibes right now. Honestly. Uh, wh wh what was the Greninja in Smash 4? I, I remember seeing him in like all the... There were Greninjas in that game? There, there was one. I Studying, I believe his name was. He, he was like the flashiest thing. He'd do all these crazy footstool combos. Oh my goodness. Rad. Smash 4! I, I, like, I'm sure it helps that you, like you mentioned, I think you mentioned, you or someone else mentioned to me earlier today that you couldn't uh, tech footstools, footstools in yeah. Smash 4, so I'm sure that helps. I, I think obviously that was pretty unbalanced, but it was, it, <laughs> boy did it feel flashy when you hit one, oh my god. Yeah, well for sure. Oh, yeah. And it'll still feel flashy this game, and it's because like, it's, I feel like it's such a, ra unless you're like really high up there with your, with your reactions, or even just, you know, from experience playing the game, yeah. it's such a crazy thing to have to think about having to tech compared to, I don't know, getting like stage spikes or something like that, so. It's just, uh, Fair. it's it's interesting. So major props to the players Ooh. that can pull off that kind of stuff consistently, because Lord knows it's not me. All right, Shelter's gonna be looking for a kill move here, because it's this is definitely the percent where you need to find this kill move, or you're gonna be struggling for a little while, because mm -hmm. Bayonetta pretty notorious for not having too many like consistent kill th uh, kill moves, kill throws, any of that, and can let uh, let other characters get to like 160-ish percent just struggling to find that kill. So. Gonna look for something to close it out here, but Ice Knight's feeling Gosh. very comfortable right here. Lots of kill moves, just like that. Get a down tilt. There it is. This are getting all the flack, and like obviously Foresight's better, but but she really been doing that since what? When, when did she come out? Like what? 2016, something like that. So yeah. she's a. Uh, I mean, it's it's so funny because of all the broken things Bay Bayo did in the Smash 4. It was like bats with him was just kind of like the cherry on top. Like yeah, it's just not, like just in case like, you thought you were gonna do anything to her. Bats with him. It's just like we can deal with the. We can deal with that. We just hate like the, all the crazy kill stuff. And now because she's toned down, it doesn't it doesn't even feel that crazy anymore. But now we have Mithra to compare. So yeah, like, exactly. And now, now we have now Mithra. It's, now it's just, just like oh, it's just that's uh, just better. We do, we we back. Oh, so back. Some oh, combos right. here, maybe. No, not quite. Hey, we will take a two hit any day of the week. Hey, just get some percent take it on. You always love to see damage it. is damage. Now some I have always struggled with against Greninja is getting edge guarded by him. I think Greninja's got a lot of great tools to just keep you off the stage. Then again, I mean, I, I I don't know how well that'll do against Bayo. I feel like Bay Bayo's got a pretty hard recovery to contest. Yeah. Like, but especially if you don't have like a projectile or something, you can right. just get wrapped in it. Oh, wow, they hit where you going? No, but I but I like but I um I think you're totally right, especially because the specifically the vertical mobility, the frog be hopping and the frog be falling, and you better beware. It's uh, yeah, that. that the, I, I talking as if I have a follow up to that, but I really don't. He's just got good vertical mobility. <laughs> he, he, he can get it. Oh, oh my! Hello. Oh, down there, there. Thank you for stopping that awkward sentence. I appreciate that, players. Okay, got another backer there. Gonna follow that up. What's the ledge trap? We're looking for some both character or both players kind of poking at each other here, just trying to find something. Shelter got a nice little combo there. Big lead here. Oh, that back here. If that was the sweet spot, that might have been it. Honestly, it's got some rage on it. One fifteen percent. This is exactly what you're looking for if you're shelter. Yeah, I don't know. Like this, Get some grass. the only way I can imagine um, Ice Knight, Ice Knight this taking bag. this through is just because of the, the classic "haha, Bayo can't kill" scenario. But like, I feel we'll like see. with Shelters being being the Scream Reaper, as I just recently learned, I can't imagine oh. that that's something that's gonna really hold you back. You're gonna find a way to yeah. do that. But <laughs> all right, <laughs> there's a one fifteen. Boy, said hey, just in case. For the one time, oh my goodness, dude! I, I, am dicey. Me, me as a Damn casual it. seeing Bayonetta smash attacks, I'm like, these yeah. are so big. These have to be the best smash attacks in the game, just because of how big they are. But their hitbox is like, yeah, the, I mean, does not look as gargantuan as a, as, yeah, a, as the actual animation. And looks. they're fine. They're just slow. They're oh just yeah, big no, leggy. no, it's just a, uh, yeah, yeah, classic. All right, big old well, smash there it is. Syndrome. Shelter found. The classic Bayo kill move, yeah, or kill confirm, lead. up tilt back here, that'll do it. So I'm assuming these guys have played a lot before. Um, does, do, who would you say normally wins? Um, I could not tell you, because uh, 
Uh, Ice Knight doesn't come to too many scrims. Oh, okay. So I, yeah. I, I honestly, because all, all I do, all, the only place I really come is here in like, right. uh, Fargo Fight Nights. But yeah, no, uh, I, I don't see, uh, I don't see these two play too much. But I know Shelter still has tons of Greninja experience in general. Okay. Just playing against Mewmon, who's uh, closer to where he is, and like Aster comes here every so uh, often. So okay. He's got, Shelter does have tons of experience, as Rick has pointed out. So, so, despite having to play the cream of the crop in terms of Greninja's in the scene, simply just being aware of many of the characters' capabilities, maybe not so oh much yeah. as play style, it can still really obviously put you yeah. up ahead. Ooh, cut the air dive. not enough to <laughs> see that one come in. So Fun fact, he is now at the nice percent, therefore he is invincible oh, for the next 10 so seconds. This is a... See, 10 seconds passed. No, no, oh, 10, 10 seconds passed. 10 God. seconds is really fast. You know days. what? Uh, My sense of time is different than yours. I guess so. And you're just going to have to hold that. Um, mm. Okay, manages to get out of there. All right. Ice Knight got a pretty... Uh, he's got. He's up a stack right now, so maybe if you can get some extra credit here, start to run away with the game here. Ooh, good. I love that. Dash run, run away, run back. Yeah. Up, yeah. Ooh, Ooh I hold wow. it out there. I, th I think I think he, he meant to do a small one, and then he saw that, it, that he did the wish time. He was like, uh, oh, oh, no. Ran out of resources. Well, you knew I was going to say by the end of that sense anyway. <laughs> oh, he, he was like, all right. <laughs> hey, honestly, like, you, you, got, you got invincibility. You come down. People aren't expecting it. I know Rick, Rickles in chat. Rickles, you've taught me better than anyone else. Sometimes the moves that they don't expect are the best. The amount of times that I've just got up 100%. to Rickles, like, turning around and throwing out a Ganon down smash. I'm like, oh, my bad. Got hit by that. No, you got me. No, even even Tweak, and I, as as someone who plays Sephiroth, and I love w watching Tweak Sephiroth, the amount of times he he spawns back in and, like, his final stock and just throws out an up smash as soon as he lands the ground. Normally, you consider, like, a Wi-Fi player tactic, but that's a top five player doing that, dude. Sometimes it just works, and you just have yeah, to man. hold that. You, you, yeah, exactly. It's just... No one's expecting it. Everyone's like, oh, such a higher level player. He's going to, uh-oh, hang on. Well, right, wait. Well, he kind of boosted the back yeah, up. Yeah, I think he helped him. He said, <laughs> he said hey, I'm not done with you. Come back. It's okay, yeah. buddy. I know you, you You lost the game, but I, I still want to make it fair, you know? You know, he's, he's, a, he's a swell frog yeah. for that. Oh, going to get some damage on here. Shelter's going to need a miracle, but he does have breathing room. He's up 2-0. I thought you were going to say so. that he had to, like, you, you said gonna. It sounded like like the word gun. He's got he's like, he's got like, to he's got to use a lot of guns. Like, oh, yeah, start cool. shooting. <laughs> you got to I mean, make it back. It, off stage, bail guns got some bang. No, yeah, it, it'll they got work. Some, they got yeah. some. Imagine if Bayo's guns went perfectly uh, horizontal instead of having, like, the little, like, upwards, like, angle. Like, imagine mm. the amount of, like, zoning that could more so could be happening like oh, if needed but uh yeah that'll happen so we move we move on we move on ice right. knight trying to make this uh reverse happen and Carmi wait so it was um was it no it wasn't ice knight that we were talking about could have made the the reverse with uh with uh because we just all saw a reverse 3 -0 happen right or did it go to game five did last night go to game five my no, memory no, is no. awful in case no, you it was three one attack okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> well, we, we talked about the game. possibility of it so literally ignore everything i'm saying so, uh there, now th th <laughs> there, there's a real possibility here we'll see if it's a replication of last set and where yeah get one game run it back or if i can run away with this get some adaptation in there there's definitely a good showing from him there a little unfortunate on shelter side because he did get an sd here yeah. or there Random thought, but because we're seeing, I, I believe this, we've been seeing, uh, wait, has a Shelter only been running this ult? Because I'm looking at now and I'm thinking, like, damn, yeah. Bayo, Bayo got a really great ults. She's she looking clean in all of them. So, yeah, what are, and I, the fact that, like, Ooh. you can have the different looks of the between the different Bayo games with her animations, depending on um, uh, which alt is from which game, is, is, so, is so rad, too. So, true. Ran, random design appreciation, you know? I, we like to get Very true. throw Sakurai a bone every now and then with, the, with those. But, uh,. Speak in terms of the gameplay, we're run, we're looking pretty even here so far. No one with a clear lead. It's just a matter of a uh, you know who, who can start uh, throwing someone off stage to get those ledge traps going. Okay, that could so be about now. Good combos Shuriken. off stage here, looking for something. Ooh, good uh, edge cancel to get the afterburner kick there. Get a little combo going, get him off stage. We'll yeah. see if oh shelter shelter's doing a pretty good job just. Being patient, patiently holding shield. Oh my lord! That move always looks five. so funny whenever it's said that way. I, I also I was wondering too because it, uh, you know we're seeing uh, Shelter go for some of these up tilts. Obviously, wind the up tilt back air confirm. And I'm wondering also how generous uh, it has to be considering in terms of percent. Like, is he has has Ice Knight already exited that window where it's no, no longer no. possible? I th I think 
this is around like the perfect percent. Like, okay. Yeah. Uh, either like it does maybe nineties to or in like earlyish one hundreds. This is this is around what yeah. you're looking for. All right. Well, he's definitely. Well, considering um, it could be awkward trying to kill in other scenarios, oh, it's Luminous being that. Although, it, it's so funny because it's like, like yeah, that was a hard time uh, killing. By the way, jab kills. Like, no, you could just jab. With the, but that move, but it's it's, it's harder to air kill. Wow. Thing. But, okay, did he did he know that they was going to just flop off the edge like that awkwardly? Like, nah, what happens I mean, sometimes? I mean, or did he throw it either out? Or, either or. Trying it to it got the, the job done, so yeah. who cares, right? It doesn't matter. Oh, it, it works. Yeah, right? We're gonna go. We're gonna throw the, the top player bone and say that it was all intentional because he knew it, that exact scenario would have happened. So, good stuff. Ice Knight having a gargantuan brain in that scenario. It, yeah, very. Oh, excuse me. Very, very big lead here for Ice Knight. So, Shelter again, kind of having some bayonetta syndrome here. Like, he really needs to close out the stock and fast because Ice Knight started running away. Wait, no, oh, okay. Throw. I guess I guess he knew it wasn't gonna kill because I, I I wasn't sure. Yeah, but it's, it's forward four throw and then like any a, any. It, sorry, you go. No, you're good. I was gonna say forward throw, and then at really, really, really high percent down throw can even kill. But I, I, that's funny. I didn't know that actually. But um, Ooh. oh, <laughs> yeah, that'll. Be. Yeah. He was just like, I'm up three stocks. I'm about to die. I'm just gonna throw out an, an option. You know, some some players will be like, it doesn't matter if I'm three stocks and at zero percent, and you're at last stock 100 yeah. percent. I'm playing as safe I as mean, humanly possible. I'm never gonna let you get the the, the lead. And then you'll, some people will feel confident and be like, all right, I've won the game. I'm just going to see if I can, you know, yeah, I mean, get you feeling nervous. I, I saw an interesting mindset tidbit from a certain player mm -hmm. who I'm not going to name. Okay. But interesting. This it, makes me wonder what you're about to say. It's, 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 it's just <laughs> for their For their privacy not, to be uh, No, it's, protected. it's just controversial. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah, uh, it was an interesting bit of uh, mindset because they're like, you know, sometimes you get, like, so much extra credit and you, can, you just – have to like understand in your head like if i die i've done really good like I, this is a good death if i die here resetting i've got tons of percent i'm gonna come back with a fresh stock and they're at high percent i this is a good death you okay know? sure I, I think that's a very interesting mindset to go about it because like yeah i feel like obviously in this game you got three stocks you lose a stock you kind of like look down you're like oh, dang, you know that that, that kind of stinks but if you've got a huge lead like Ice Knight, if you lose a stock, you've got to just be like, all right, this, this is, sorry, I've done crazy amounts of work this stock. I've got tons of space to play. I just need to play my smart game and bring this home, you know, stuff like that. Based on something Ooh. that you just said, remind me to tell a, a, um, a funny story between sets, but let's focus on this for now. For sure. Um, but Close. Oh, okay. Oh, if, mm, bear, okay. 160. Qu gonna question. Does Bayo having max rage, like, significantly change, like, her combo last year? Like, does this just make the game I, harder for her? I have no idea. Because, Ooh, like, the combo. I, I have to imagine not really, because it's not like the, her moves are... Because it's not like she's doing combos and the moves send you far away and then the katana continues. Uh -oh. like, it doesn't. It, I don't think. I don't think uh -oh. rage would have. A, okay, maybe in scenarios like that, it uh -oh, might have an impact. That I don't was know. Risky. Up air's gonna yeah, do it. Well, no yeah, way. Yeah, okay. Yeah. All right. Well, you know, I say was. Well, it was three stocks to one at one point, and so yeah. that shelter trying to. Uh, it was looking a little much scarier to the point where Ice Knight was going to have a lot of momentum. Say if that up smash hit back when he was still at three stocks. Yeah, now right. and then he would have a lot of momentum. But oh, because yeah. that one thing didn't hit, now I feel like Shelter's got momentum going into that game yeah. three just because he almost won it after yeah, that. Yeah, he, so. he almost called back from the depth there. We'll see. Yes. One in the game five. Ice Knight Go brought it all the way back. We'll see. Been sticking on small battlefield here yet again. Run it back all set. Ugh. We'll see. Okay, which one of these dudes loves Xenoblade? Because this song is all the only song I've been playing the entire set. Or maybe it was someone from a previous set. Not saying it's bad, no, but I mean, we have some... This this is Smash Ultimate. We've got over a thousand songs in this game, baby. Honestly, it might be from last set, but I don't think yeah. so. I, they, prob I, they don't care. The top... Yeah, they, a lot, some players just do not care at all about music, but... You gotta think about the viewer experience. <laughs> Uh, I, I saw Rickles in chat earlier said you gotta change the song, dog. We do, we do oh, so up. we're of a similar mindset. He gets it. He gets it. All right. It, oh. Yo, best Ganondorf agrees with me. I got some correct opinions. That's all I got. <laughs> we're right. hey, we're off. We're off, baby. All right. We all out. Right. We out. So, so I, I, I already. I, so I mentioned a possibility of like someone probably having nice. a bigger momentum, but it didn't look that way until now with that now, good confirm. I, I, I was gonna kind of bring this up a little bit earlier, and don't get me wrong. I think Shelter's a phenomenal player, but and I think Bayonetta's a good character. But I feel like whenever I play against Bayo, I just kind of hold shield on stage because it's just a matter of time until a Bayo player side beats on the ground. I feel like that is literally a death sentence. Kinda oh, like yeah. If you side me into a shield, like, you're cooked. 
I don't know. And that's what happened there. I mean, he side being the shield. Ice Knight got that down tilt up smash ready. He yeah, no, this dude, this is looking like a reverse 3 0 in the making. Ice Knight's like, I, mm, I lose his bracket. Mm, never heard of him. Never heard of him. Yeah, right. I think I'm we'll gonna see. Up smash now. It's gonna be close. Shelter's gonna need to close out the stock pretty quick, racking up the damage. <laughs> this frog is full of bullet holes. <laughs> get, return the Greninja and get a new one from the PC, dude. <laughs> is, this, this one's oh. been through enough. Oh my goodness. Doesn't kill even. Oh! Uh oh, uh, caught the air dodge. Uh, Shelter's off stage, gotta crawl back. Oh! Okay, yeah, that's what we like to see. Wow, what? that was smooth. Hey, remember I said Shelter was gonna have some momentum going into this game five? I actually was lying and I did a commentator thing where like, uh, I just I, I just wanted you guys to feel the suspense, but I, I knew I knew I snuck out this dude. It, it, I, I can see in the future, it's fine. That was crazy. Ice Knight's got tons of momentum. He says, I want this reverse 3-0. I am not done with oh, my yeah. winner's run. Not. All right, well. Up hey. tilt up here. We'll close it out I, once again. I don't know. He had that confirmed. Shelter's going to need a <laughs> there miracle. There you go. I guess it makes sense. All right. Oh, he's got some combos here. Oh, that was a oh, good edge cancel into the ABK. Bringing him up. Uh, wow. Okay. He, wow. Okay. he was like, I'm going to get it again. Cheeky. He was like, ah. Little cheeky. I see you, Ice Knight. He, he tried to do an F smash there. He's, he's, he's oh, like he off stage. To, he's looking like he wants to uh -oh. really clean this up. He does not want this to go oh. last stock like last game did. Shelter getting very aggressive off stage there. You're going to need something to even this back up. Need a miracle. Down tilt fair. Not going to do it yet. Very, <laughs> very. Er, nah, I, I can't say close yet. Yeah, I think he realized he was facing yeah. the wrong way a little too late. And he was just like, ah, well. Uh oh, uh, there it is. Uh, yeah, not going to no, do it no, yet. No. Looking at. What are we doing? What are we doing? What's, we the, what's, the, what's the move? Shelter's gonna need a kill. Can't hit that shield with that witch twist on line. Looking for something oh, bare. Man. Not gonna Dude. do it. When was the last? When was the last time I saw you in? It feels like it's okay. I'm just okay. Never mind. Uh oh. <laughs> there. Oh, is that it? Not I, oh, down the smash will do it. That's such a great dodge. confirm. If you if he knew if he air dodges through the four air, yeah. you you you're like I said, it's that it's that vertical mobility that's this frog view. Yeah, you just yeah, the frame drop exactly. You drop immediately, throw out the down smash. Unless you got unless the air dodge sends you or you got like bigger drifts with the, whatever character you're playing, you are just yeah, you're cooked. You among are the cooked. deceased at that point. What can I say? What can Reaper I say? got oh Robert. no, don't let him see the comment. Oh no. But uh, yeah, I guess you kind of right. Though, good, so, yeah. good stuff to Ice Knight there. Yeah, winner's final. Uh, is uh wait, it's Hattle versus Reaper? Wait, yes, yeah, so that, 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 that was losers. Yes. Oh shoot, I thought for I, I don't know why I thought we were winners, but now you know what I you know what I forgot that we didn't commentate the first set of top eight. So yeah, that, that, it, that it, was, it okay. was Ice Knight. I was in Lo Lois's. All right, it was Ice Knight Raven yep. King, correct? Very, very. Nice. All right, Tatter Raven King. So, but the, but we still got the next. Oh, we got Raven King in here right now, Raven King. You got any wise words for? Oh, yeah, he's leaving. Hey. Yeah, oh, oh, you got any wise words for the people at home? Gaming. Oh, gaming. Dude, you hear it here first. Dude, I think that was pretty controversial. I think we're gonna have to ask him to DQ. That, <laughs> oh, that, that, was, that was. I didn't think about that. You know. You know. You know. Honestly, he, he, he didn't pronounce it right. He pretty. He didn't. There was no. There was no e after the m when when he just said that. Not, yeah, that was gaming. No, he just said gam. <laughs> that, mm. I'm sorry. You know what? I'll have to. I'll have to bring up my my qualms. All right, We're gonna so switch sounds down. good. All right, awesome. All right, this means I gotta tell my story now. Okay, so uh, when you you mentioned earlier about like uh, when you like lose a stock, you, you just kind of shake your head and you're just like, oh man, that happened. And that immediately made me think of like you know when like the commentators at like Summit like a couple summits ago were like grilling the Buzz for like whenever like <laughs> whenever the Buzz gets killed by anything, he's just like you, you just he just does like a wild like like shake of the head. He's like that killed like whatever. I remember thinking <laughs> that like why why would someone do that when they obviously are are gonna die? Like it's so silly. Flashback to an hour ago, me playing in bracket gets killed by Minecraft Steve at 150. I shake my head and I'm like, oh god, I did the thing. Oh, I, I, I did the, the I, buzz. I, nah. I, I did the, the buzz and I was like, oh man, now I can't make fun of it anymore because I literally did. Ah, oh, that's funny. Well, that was a silly anecdote <laughs> that I thought worth mentioning. Oh, they're changing the song. Let's go. This Wait. Is great. Oh no, you didn't pick a song. It still says counter. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh wait, are we doing winners finals? No. Yeah, this is winners. Final oh, okay, right now. I thought we had another set of losers to go. Nope. Um, but here we go. All right, I, 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 this is this is one I want to see because uh, it's gonna be these are be these are two pick. titans of Chicago. That's yeah, I, this is <laughs> getting to commentate this on BGBC is I, a dream, this baby. Is, this, yeah, this, I'm not just happy to be here. This is seed one and two respectively, meeting in winners finals. Seeding going as the prophecy prophesied. Uh, it's, it's the prophecy <laughs> foretold, I presume. 
Oh yeah, saying foretold instead of prophesized, that was yeah, that, you that know. was better. No, I just effectively said the word, pro word prophecy twice. That was a little silly. But we got wait, is this just counterattack? But again, I can't tell. No. This is still okay. It's still Xenoblade. I had to. <laughs> I had to check. Is this counter? No. No, it's not. Okay, it's still Xenoblade. So. Yeah. Xenoblade I'm, music's I'm, fine. What, what kind of music? You you picking the song? What you going to? Uh, go to? I'm picking this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going back to the buzz because the buzz likes picking the the world. The <laughs> He's going to the buzz. He's picking. No, the, the no, no, buzz no, no. Because no. the buzz always picks like the world of light ending music or or like the world of light boss music, and literally that's what I like to do too. But I play my own music, so I haven't had to do that for a while. But I, I'm the buzz pilled. What can I say? Ever since that Kagaribi, I'm a I, I, I'm huge the buzz he fan. Took what can the I say? Buzz pill. I'm big the you buzz. You know who else is the buzz pilled? Because I remember uh, I remember the story now. Yeah. Uh, Kirby 509. Oh, uh, is he? Uh, on Star <laughs> GG, their name. Is Deshaun, and it's just because someone edited a picture of his face <laughs> over the buzz. It's like this is uh, the Deshaun. Uh, to please tell me he was doing the lipo mode face too. Uh, okay. Well, that, that thing has to be edited. But anyways, I guess we should talk about our winners' finals in here at String Showdown number 82, folks. Oh, yeah. and he's, uh, what? Rickle said it best. I thought it, I thought he was good. Rickle said it best. This local is really cool. 53 entrants. You guys don't want to miss this. <laughs> 53. <laughs> Yeah, uh, come to Scrims, guys, if you can. That's pretty dope. Uh, mm -hmm. Dope venue. Monday nights. This is the best venue. Boom. Uh, and I'm totally not biased because this is all I go to. <laughs> yeah, like, literally me. Uh, unironically, <laughs> like, I, I've gone to my fair share of locals. This is phenomenal. This is a phenomenal venue. Uh, you get nothing but like the most kind of people here. You got dual monitor set up for oh. every single set. Oh, don't forget the split headphone jack. Everyone, <laughs> no. Everyone's got audio. Well, I, it's I've so been nice. to majors that don't have that. It, it's it's cool as a, as, as a hex scene. Uh, good um, the, yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> hey, I was like, hey, hey, oh, good save. I got to remember what they told me before I went on the chair. Uh, right. yeah, that um, it's cool seeing right. locals have that kind of yeah. um, quality in the in their in their weeklies, might I add, weekly. Yeah. So really, really cool. Absolutely. Um, All right, back to the game. Cementing now. a really good lead right off the bat. Yeah, I gotta Raven say, King cooking him up, got him off stage here. Uh, he's just yeah. yeah he I, was just like, ah, can I hit you with it? Uh, could I have uh, chase him away. twenty more percent, please? No. Oh, you shall perish. Crazy rebels guard I'll, to but to I guess I'll get a kill. Try the rebels right. guard to get out of there, but not quite gonna do it. Teta all over him. Not gonna let him fly with that. He's got a big stock lead here, so Teta's gonna need some. Oh, he's looking for the chain PK fire there. Not gonna get it. Also, Rickle saying that he should come to this local, just giving me flashbacks of when I, last time I was here. We we played in bracket before this, and he told. And then after I, we played, he explained the Ganondorf tech he used on me to win. And I'm like, Ganondorf has tech? And he's like, Yeah, he's telling me about it. And I'm like, What? <laughs> you are actually making this up. This character is okay. It was it was so silly, but 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 it, it's, it's always a party when Rickles comes out too. So another reason why you guys should go, because he can tell you Ganondorf tech when you lose to him. It's pretty dope. <laughs> no, I, I that would blew my mind. Oof. But it's uh looking to close it out. Nah, it's uh our, our sends out, baby. Our sends out. It's yeah. uh not I mean not anymore, but our you got you got another stock with it and I don't know how it, Ness could get through that. You are Oh shield huge. That'll do it. Alright, I was about to say you gotta you gotta outplay the, the top player, but uh some sometimes you can just Ness up smash there it is. but drag down. I bra I present Joker. Uh oh, Tasabu. Who's this Tasabu guy? See me smash six moves shirtless guy. They're about to completely re. Dude. Okay, no, hear me out. Ganondorf has always been like the character where it, throughout Smash Brothers is just like, oh, he's the bad character that's heavy, hits hard, and casuals love him because he's bad, but he hits hard, so casuals love him. I just said the same sentence twice in a row, but I'm, I just had to exemplify my point. If they've changed his moveset in Smash 6 to exemplify Tears of the Kingdom, and he has a whole different moveset, oh which character Tears? in Smash replaces that archetype? Because you got to have oh, one character in Smash Bowser. that's just so... Do they make... Okay, but Bowser is like upper mid-tier. Like, do they really oh, you put in that bottom one? No. Because oh, there has oh, to be... Oh, you need a bottom one. You need, you, need a, you need an archetype in Smash where it's just your bottom one trash character that's a heavy and just hits hard, but is just god-awful in every other a aspect. <laughs> that's what, like... Aside, they can have, like, one or two maybe good moves. Like, what character in Smash replaces Ganondorf if they decide to actually give him a better moveset? Uh... Or a worse move set. Put Rob down there. We do not need him as a top tier yeah, again. Yes, yeah, <laughs> literally. Like the character had literally not even a video game character. We could shake on that, right, guys? Put put Rob at bottom one. Ro that Rob would be hype. Would be hype. Rob, I was watching some Coney the other day, and as one does, Coney made a remark about how it was like Rob was like mid and like 
Oh yeah. Ball and like mid yeah, and PM I think I, I think I, I, and like yeah. mid in Smash Four, and you like you like coming to ultimate. You're like, oh, Rob's gonna be mid again. And then you're like, oh wait, he's absurd. This is a problem. They wanted Rob to become. Yeah. They wanted Rob to have his time in the spotlight, and boy, does he have it! Imagine being a Pichu main in melee, and then starting, and then ultimate before he got nerfed, and just the whiplash of seeing your character yeah. be good, and then having to go back down the trenches. But uh, hey, the video game is oh. happening on screen, I guess. Uh, yeah, okay, the Tata definitely having like a, like a better start. It's just a matter of if you can uh, maintain the lead, because that's always that's always the goal, right? These these top players they be adopted, and we don't we don't want Ooh. that to happen. Oh. Boom. That happened. Hello. Why did he? Okay, that was that was interesting. I don't I know. It's got to be 170. Okay, <laughs> uh, surely <laughs> that's gonna do it. One little yeah. bullet, dude. That's all it takes. Ding. Gotcha. <laughs> Ibex is in chat. He plays Rob. He's he, as we're slandering Rob. Oh, <laughs> Ibex. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Sorry, Ibex. I, I saw him, but your character got me feeling so. Oh my. I completely oh my, agree. Oh just my because gosh. I completely agree just because I played Ibex in the Smash Ultra online thingy when that was happening, and I got creamed. So for that reason, I bear such a, <laughs> a uh, what's, uh, what's her, anti-Rob bias. <laughs> I, I remember in, um, I'm back, just kidding, back, back he's, at, he's dope with it. Back in my old high school Smash Club, uh, we would do like a different silly tournament each week. Oh, uh, sure. And one week we just, because this was only when Smash 4 was out, Ultimate was now, but we brought back Brawl for one week. Um, and no one knew how Ooh. to play Brawl. Good dragon yeah. combo to their kill. Classic. But anyway, yeah. we brought back Brawl, and no one oh, knew sure. how to play Brawl, and let alone it's a high school Smash Club. No one knows how to play Smash. So I literally just picked Rob and Brawl and did like thir 300 falling nares. Yeah, And yeah. that's all I would do in the game, and I got like second in the whole tournament just by doing falling nares because no one knew how to punish it. So, so what it you're telling so me is that funny. what you're telling me is that Rob was never mid. It was just that no one played him correctly until ultimate. <laughs> the, the future is bright. You you had to go back to the yeah. past and tell people this is how you played the Guys, character. Falling nares. The whole meta could have been changed. No one knew what they were doing. He just had to use one move. Okay. Uh, well, speaking of using the only one oh move, Ness Lord, does yeah. that well, and Hooks you're him dead. Up. <laughs> Got him off stage there. That PK Thunder is going to give him, keep him off. Oh just a very uh, pretty close match, but kind of ran away with it there at the end. 1-1 one, yeah. one to uh, in a Tata Raven King here. A Tata Raven King. These are our winner's finals. I almost called them champions, but neither of them is a champion yet. They're just warriors, and, but they're fighting for the championship. Good Watch state. us now I as we go to game three and see what happens. Doing my sounds, it sounds like a epic trailer voice. It sounds like uh, we'll be right back with <laughs> cartoons on Friday. <laughs> sounds like that, you know. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, All right. Three, honestly, two, this one, Ness's fit right here. I, maybe this is because I go to school in Boston, but he should just have a Red Sox hat on. Nah. You're already I, close to it. You got the red and white. This is this is my, this is my favorite Ness fit, and it is, I, I it don't, is good. I don't even know why. I I think. It's because I play Pokemon a lot, and my favorite Pokeball was always the Premier Ball. Because it did nothing, but it just looked sure. cooler than the It does one. look cool. So I always, every time I saw this Nest fit, I'm like, this is the Premier Ball fit. Yeah. Also, switching also to the to the red, like, um, blood. That's what that's what he just did with Joker. He's <laughs> like, he's like the, this this red symbolizes the blood you spilt by by destroying me last game, and now you're not Ooh, There's so much lore to this. Wow, you you guys good. don't know. These guys are, are my best friends, despite me never going to locals. Oh, we yeah. know each other so well, and this is what's going through their heads. Oh, no, me as the commentator, the mind I have the reader. authority here. Yeah. Oh, great wise mind reader. What am I thinking of right now? Uh, you th uh, well, I don't know about you. I'm thinking about the players. They're actually on my own attention. You know, oh, I, I, yeah, oh. we're, can, we're, we're just not we're just. I just don't know you like that, man. What can I say? It's just because we're besties. And I'm never coming back. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Yep. All right. Anyways, all right. Um, our bud, our buddy here is gonna be trying to recover, Ooh. but you got PK fired. Uh, PK but, fired. PK Thunder, Thunder trying to keep won't him away. It. Won't get it. Won't get it. Okay. Does he do it again? He does do it again. Yeah, and that same it. thing we saw his first set there, pressuring him with the PK fire to either react to it with maybe an air dodge or rebels guard just like then. When you rebels guard, you're stuck in that animation for quite a while, so he punishes that. Yeah, I do be forgetting that sometimes, uh, and I just be like, or like forget that I can grab it. So, yeah, this like is why I'm a one tour. <laughs> I, I feel like there's a lot of characters that honestly have that, and you just don't really think. No, you give them so much respect over it. There's it, just it, the, there's one in particular because yeah. I played against him today. Yeah. Um, Bowser Jr. Uh huh. I, I Bowser the Jr. The ever so popular. 
I mean, it's, it's pretty niche, but I feel like Bowser Jr. is just like, there's constantly stuff going on. It's can be okay, but what specifically? What scenario are you it talking was, about? It was down beat. When Bowser Jr. deploys the Mecha Koopa, they're in so much lag from just shooting it out. So, like, huh. I, would, I used to give them so much respect because just I cause, didn't know that. oh, there's a Mecha Koopa on the stage now. I need to respect it. But no, as soon as they do that, just jump over and start fighting them because, like, it, it, it's crazy how much I'm gonna keep that, that in mind. Yeah. It's just, I, I feel like a lot of characters have that. You just, But obviously, oh. you don't play them, so you don't notice stuff like that. For it's sure, interesting. Sure. Ooh, F-Tilt going to close it out. Pretty close game coming back to the game here. Yeah, all right. Literally, very fitting considering how the, the set is so tied to. These players being seen 1-2, obviously super evenly matched, but still only one must move on. Oh. Ooh, well, off stage, well, looking for footsie. something. They, they've been playing at this ledge for like the past minute. They're, they're playing oh, well, Omega off footsies. Oh, oh, you know what he was looking for. Wait, oh, what? Did the up smash. smash like? Up smash clanked with the PK Thunder. Oh, down smash. Yeah, that'll do it. Right. See you later. Hashtag silly goose moment if I've ever seen one. All right. Oof. Yes, announcer, he did win. You're so, you're so real for that. <laughs> I got to give him credit where the credit's due. But I should also give a tad of credit for that. Rad down smash. He came in clutch <laughs> when he needed to the most. So true. I see Shelter in the back. Shelter, what are you doing over there? What a silly guy. The Skrm Reaper. He got food. Just use your eyes, you silly goose. Oh, okay. Game oh, oh, four! Oh, oh. Game, game? Now yeah, let four. Now, little, now you guys may have wondered, game four Leo, what happened? Ga game game four Leo be getting destroyed these days, you know? What happens? Little did you know that his that it transferred over to the next big Joker main, our boy Raven King. He's gonna uh, he's gonna go on a war path. I can feel this game four Raven King about to go crazy. That's just my prediction though. We'll see what happens. I could I could be talking randomly. We'll see. Oh Ooh. but Atata obviously is gonna try to fight it. Who knows what he's gonna do? All right. Hey, that ain't Leo hate. That's Leo analysis. <laughs> I'm, I'm just spitting. <laughs> no, I, I don't. Don't. I, I love the. I love the guy, dude. He, he's an amazing player. Game four Leo is just a myth now. That's all. <laughs> Dang. Cut cold. You, you telling me you took Leo to game four? You got that? Oh yeah. No, oh, that's, of course. No, I, I meet. You know, every time me and Leo have played, you know, <laughs> Leo's never oh, beat me. That's all I can say. He's never. Oh, he's never beaten me. That's true. I never thought about he's that. He's literally every time we play it, or can contrast every time we've not played. He's he's never won. So <laughs> he's so wise. I will never be beaten by <laughs> like just grab a player. I will never lose to Ice Knight because I will never play Ice Knight. The wise man. Oh, doesn't quite get the recovery there. You got to think in f terms of four dimensions where they can at least expect it. All right. All right. These got Arsene out. Going to need this damage. You're obviously scared of Arsene when you're close to kill percent, but at low percent, he's still just going to bread and butter your way up to 46 oh, yeah. anyways just off of one interactor. Are you dead? Uh oh, oh I actually the magnet. I am very surprised by sometimes by the range of Joker's tether recovery. Maybe it's because I don't see it 100% of the time just because, you know, sometimes he just doesn't have it when he has Arsene. But that, I feel like that tether is suspiciously more range than I expect it to sometimes. It's because they're cheating. <laughs> Five head. <laughs> Anything it's that causes them to win is cheating. The Everything. players are hacking. <laughs> Hacker players. It really is that easy. Top players oh. are actually no better than the rest of us. They're just playing on a <laughs> alternate copy of <laughs> Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Why did that? It's it's so obvious. It's every setup they play is completely <laughs> custom to their own desires and how they want to play the game. I forget. There you go. That'll be oh fun. no! And he's gonna get and back. He and he's gonna get so back. So for instance, any other nest could not have made that recovery <laughs> possible, but Atata here making sure to. Oh my lord! Uh, he's a, actually a master coder. No one knows that he is graduating from computer science at Harvard. Do they even, is that, are they known for computer science? I don't know. The point is, yeah, he's just, yeah. He, he's, no. That was a crazy recovery. Obviously there. just a very good player in that scenario, just perfectly drawing a circle. Big back here, most. though. There you he go. Got, excuse me. He's got Arsene online, though, at the start of the stock, so we'll see if he can, he's, he had like a full meter, too, so we'll see if he can capitalize on this. He's going to need some, uh-oh, uh-oh. I might have spoke too soon. Damn. There it is. That'll close out the whole set. 3-1 goes to the, the Tata. Below. 
Flying out Leo to the next Grim Scruple, is that? Okay, well, that's <laughs> that's really crazy you say that, because conveniently, I just don't think I'm going to be feeling really well that day. I think, you know, I'm, I might, I, my throat might be a little scratchy that morning. I'm, I just, I'm going to want to do every, I'm just going to want to be decent and, like, not want to give anyone whatever I might be having, so. Oh, uh, yeah, of course. I'm just, sure. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, right. the, I'm just the bigger man, that's all I can say. Oh, yeah, of course, naturally. All right, uh, are we trading off yes, here? Yes, I believe we commentators are, are switching off. Who we got coming now. in? Who's stealing our um, spot? Who's stealing our gusto? It's, it's been a freaking honor and a half to be on, commentate on the VG bootcamp stream. I yeah. was, I, la I waited all spring semester for this going home and I'll be like, and I, hey, if, if y'all are sick of me now, I'm here the rest of the summer, so I, I hope you aren't. Please, I sincerely hope you're not. Um, but anyways, it, it, was, it, it was great to perform. Yeah, yeah, it's absolutely. It's been a pleasure. Tournament, or, tournament's not over. Stay tuned. Oh, that was, only, oh, that sure. was only winner's finals. We got more matches to come. We got Ice Knight versus whoever's about to sit down over there that mm -hmm. I can't see yet. Um, Actually, the, the scr you see the scrims guy, oh, the it's orange the, guy? It's, it's scrim. Mr. Scrim. Mr. Scrim. Mr. Scrim. All right, awesome. Uh, we're going to hand know. off the commentary <laughs> here in just a second to whoever's coming on. That's... Uh, Excelsior and who? Icarus and Excelsior. They're great commentators. You're going to want to stick around almost oh. as cool as me, but not quite. Those are some um, cool but yeah, tags. You know, Dang. Yeah, awesome. They're, they're, they're great, guys. So stick around. we got more great matches to come. I'm Typical. I'm here with my friend Scruple. That's me. Y'all have a great rest of your night now. Peace. Wait, what? Yo, we're on? Oh, we're on? What in the world? Let's go, dude. I'm Excelsior. I'm Icarus. And welcome to Scrims Showdown number 82. Getting into losers semis here. We've got Ice Knight versus Kirby 509. Are, are we standing for this, this no, block? No, I want to sit down. Oh, well, then why haven't you sat down? Why haven't you sat down? Because uh, you didn't sit down. You didn't sit down either. That's what I thought. All right. <laughs> How's it going, everyone? How's it happening? On the VGBC channel, we are. Um, what's our what's our like casting duo name? Bro, I don't know. Okay. Was I supposed to think of it? I mean, you you can think of it now. Well, now I don't want to. Okay. <laughs> Yo, they're starting. Oh That's yeah, crazy. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Smash Bros. Am I right? Smashy Bros. Uh, Let's see, we got Ice Knight versus um, Kirby 509, Green Energy versus Olimar. This is going to be an interesting one. Uh, we're already, I didn't realize this is losers semis. Who's in winners? Uh, winners is Atata and Atata. Huh. Because yeah. we have we have losers semis, losers oh, finals, right. and grands. Yeah, but so. um, Kirby 509 kind of running away here. 79% uh, on Ice Knight, uh, almost essentially unanswered, doing a really good job, kind of walling him out, not mm. letting him... Uh, do too much here. Yeah. Uh, we were just talking about this earlier, about how uh, Olimar is like a huge matchup check character, yeah, especially yeah. like here. And what? Oh, he's dead. Hello. What? <laughs> oh my. Bro, he just kept hitting him with up air and he the just brother was died. holding straight up. He had to have been, because that's insane. That should have never killed him there at 70. Yeah. So... Uh, yeah, we were just talking about, oh, yeah, Olimar is this silly little guy. Um, Greninja can just do that. I mean, he apparently. had to have been holding straight up for that, dude. Right. There's no way. Yeah, I mean, I don't even think Kirby expected that to kill when it did. No, probably not. But good on him not uh, losing faith just yet, you know. Uh, mm -hmm. Still holding it out, doing a nice... Uh, he can't seem to find the kill here, but uh, missed read from Ice Knight on the up smash. What's the punish here? 
Nothing yet. I'm still waiting. Yeah, just kind of throwing out a lot of Pikmin here. The footstool, not going to get the spike. He's really looking for that, but not getting that two frame yet. Yep. 163, that's very much the danger zone. Yeah, but I mean, if you're Kirby 5 and I'm here, you know, there's not a lot you can. Like, it, it's yeah, hard. I mean, you right? can just kind of chuck the purple and hope that it. Hit, well, yellow oh, you can do that. works. Yeah, 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 that works. All right, back to two stocks. Down smash, going to send him flying. Yeah, and that forward the air. forward air going to send him flying into the blast zone. So we've got a full stock, clear, stock lead here for Ice Knight. Speaking yeah. is difficult. This isn't looking good. This game one is not looking very good for uh, Kirby mm -hmm. here because, I mean, he cannot get off this ledge. He isn't, like, the kill he got was kind of lucky. Okay, but here he is kind of... Going for the combo there, really good stuff. Not letting himself getting edge guard oh my too God. much. This purple Pikmin it has putting put in, in work. So much putting work. in the work, dude. We'll and he just threw him away, but he goes for the spike. Nice. That shot. was that was filth. That was absolutely filthy. Really good whistle. But oh god, I was about to say it's not even gonna matter, but uh, I think that was Di that made him miss that confirm there. So good Di from Kirby. Ooh, really good stuff shielding throughout that entire uh, counter there. Not mm -hmm. letting himself get too scared there because, I mean, he was angling up, Ice Knight was, so it's like that yeah. was going to go. But that down tilt into the up smash is going to take the stock. Kirby's coming on. You're going for the run back. Not happy about that. Yeah. But, I mean, to be fair, he kind of was bringing that back towards the end there. Yeah, he, he definitely had something cooking there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, just, you know, should have left the oven on a little bit longer. Yeah, maybe a little bit. <laughs> But, um, yeah, here we go. Yeah, just trying to straight back to small battlefield. Um, let's see how Kirby can kind okay. of... Okay, he um, did switch to green Olimar, which ooh. could be either a, a, a miss input or um, a power play. Because, we, I mean, we did see um, uh, Raven King enter his villain arc and go to red Joker instead what? of blue Joker last he match. Did? He did? How did I miss that? Because you were playing friendless. I was playing Pichu. Pichu was friendly. He's he's shaped like a friend, but you know Pichu he's not shaped like a friend. Though. This ninja frog that is uh, being torn through right now. Yeah, not looking too good. I mean, 55% isn't too bad. Uh, Kirby 509 just doing a really good job, kind of keeping uh, Ice Knight kind of boxed out here. Mm -hmm. But Ice Knight firing back real real quick here. Yeah, Greninja Nair seems to be the move for just eliminating all the Pikmin. Yes, which is really convenient that he just has one move that will take all of the Pikmin away. I um, I had a move like that. Yeah. Ooh, he's Kirby got 509's like that. in the Myron zone right now. Two purples and a blue on deck. So his throws and all of his uh, normal attacks are going to be pretty beefy right now. Ooh, really good and spot dodge. speaking of that... Yeah, avoiding that grab from Ice Knight there. Uh, see what more he can get. 42 on him already. 52. Let's see if he can take it further. What's the edge guard? Red Pikmin here doing some doing some hits, but um, yeah, he's gonna be able to get down, reset sort of the neutral. And right now, Kirby Fabian is doing a really good job playing super evasive, not letting mm -hmm. uh, Ice not get too much off. But as I say that, can I get the Nair into the up smash to confirm? Um, our Star KO is so funny. He just goes Bwack! with his big ol' eyes. Yeah, Ice Knight, uh, not looking too happy with his controller right now. Uh, see how that's going to affect him. He was kind of holding down the uh, a button repeatedly there and just not doing anything. Mm -hmm. well, hopefully it's not broken, because that's the last thing you want is, you know, controller issues. Because, oh, yeah, you know, play, player issues you can always, like, work through, but, like, someone is out of your control like that, yeah, yeah, yeah. that's, it's really, can be really frustrating. Yeah, but good air dodge from Kirby. Not going to be enough, though. Uh, going to reset the situation back on the other platform to make the kill. Ice Knight, but oh really good God. up smash through the nair. Purple Pikmin. Yeah. Bottom text, I guess. Bottom text purple. Kirby 509 is doing a really good job with these whistles uh, off stage, kind of mm. not letting Ice Knight do too much damage to him. But um, even as I say that, it's not looking great for Kirby here. 70% almost essentially unanswered. Getting a little antsy with that up smash. What can Kirby do here? Well, he knew the whistle was coming and he yeah. waited it out, but no real punish there from Ice Knight. Let's see how this game closes out. 85 to... Oh, that was... Not a great good back air there, getting a little extra percentage. Yeah, things 
aren't looking too good for uh, Kirby here. We'll see what he can do, if he can cook up. It is last stock for both both players there. But and even as I say it. that, yeah, that Ice Knight's going to take the stock. All right, Ice Knight, I think, going to swap his controller. Nah, not check his controller. Check him. I don't know what I'm saying. Kirk Kirby looks defeated. Yeah, not a good look for Kirby right now. Kind of really kind of shaking his head there in the uh, in the player cam at the end there. Mm -hmm. uh, really not happy about the way that last game went. But I mean, I think that if he can kind of pull himself together here, he mm -hmm. can. He, he's taken Ice Knight to last stock both times now. Right. So what he needs, he just needs to clutch it out from there. But let's see how he mm -hmm. can do that going into game number three. Dude, up smash into up smash is such a funny combo. People complain when I can do stupid combos, but Olimar's allowed to do up smash up smash twice in a row. Well, yeah, but he only does like 20%. Steve He's combos. At 50. <laughs> listen, listen. Unban Steve. Agreed. That's all I gotta say. I agree. But, uh. Oh, good. Good there. He doesn't have a jump, I don't think, but Greninja's so slippery. Yeah. Not gonna take the stock just yet, but a really good position to be in if you're Kirby here. Not gonna get the two frame, but let's see what else he can do. He's really got Ice Knight really on the back foot there and taking the stock. Yeah. He he heard our advice apparently, just you know clutch up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nut up or shut up, I guess. <laughs> can I say that? Oh well. I think so. Alright. 94, can you definitely want to close this stock out now rather than later before Kirby gets a whole bunch of extra percent on yeah. this. Um, but, uh... Ooh, that's not a good look. Yeah. But, I mean, he's got 46% sloppy, but of extra credit, and he's got a purple on deck, so let's see how he can use it to his advantage here. Can I toss another pickings there? Let's see. Yeah, I think the thing that I've been noticing is that Ice Knight has been going in with Nair a lot yeah, to yeah. in order to like dissuade those Pikmin. And I believe Nair, or it at least seems to me that Nair is a lot more punishable on approach than some of uh, Greninja's other moves. Like, right, right. you know, like dash attack, which he'd normally approach with. That was a really good uh, whistle from uh, Kirby there, uh, mm -hmm. avoiding those forward air. And, but I mean, not ju just barely not enough. Are we not looking happy about that? Kind of shaking his head there. But he, I mean, we, we've seen him yeah. take him. Yeah, take he's this not stock really here. down much at all. And he, yeah, not up down to any at all. No, not at all. Even stocks, even game here. Let's see what either player can make do here. Is are we going to be able to, you know, get a game on the board, or is Ice Knight just going to kind of steamroll with another three, uh, with a three out? I feel like he could get, he could easily take a game here. Yeah. So let's see if uh, Ice Knight's going to allow it to happen. Because right now, Ice Knight is not looking to let that happen. He's looking to go three games unanswered. Yeah, he is. He has been looking pretty good here, but Kirby is, is not, you know, rolled over and let it happen by any stretch of the imagination. No, no, no. Ooh, oh, really good, good whistle, whistle to get through that up smash. 99% now. How is Ice Knight going to take this? Probably looking for down tilt up smash. Yeah. Or Oh, he was looking for that uh, reversal right there. Yeah, really bad counter uh, coming out from Ice Knight, but no punish on it. Both of them kind of reset into the sides there. Yeah. And this could be anyone's game, right? I mean, mm -hmm. Ice Knight Curb just needs one good pick, confirm. Man. Ice Knight just one, one good move to hit, and that's like that? going to take it. Yeah. Oh, not happy. No, no but hey, happy. well played. Yeah. Yeah. Just not not enough clutching out from Kirby there. Uh, kind of a, a bad kind of. Uh huh. Oh, I didn't hear what happened. My hands are up. I don't know nothing. Yeah, I, don't I didn't know see nothing. nothing. I didn't hear nothing. All right, but, but Ice Knight's Knight. gonna move on. Yeah, Ice Knight going to now face I think Raven King. Yes. So we got number It'll one, number two fighting it out here. Yep, Ice Knight Raven King for losers finals here, and then winner gets to um, play a Tata yeah. in Grands. So we'll see if. Raven King will be able to get his run back in uh, in Grands from from Winners Finals, but um, you know, Ice, uh, no, Ice Knight, Knight has King. been looking pretty dominant yeah. in the sets that I've seen of his today. Oh yeah, but I mean, who did he lose to? Um, let's see. Can we see who Ice Knight lost to? I'm pulling it up. 
we're about to lose screen here, aren't we? Greninja. Greninja. Okay. <laughs> My phone is loading. Start GG. Such a fantastic website. Mm-hmm. Raven King actually sent Ice Knight to, Ooh, so to losers in winter semis. A run back. So, yeah. Definitely going to get the run back. And uh, he's back to Blue Joker. So no no more villain uh, Raven King. We were saying last week that um, Raven King is um, Steve Buscemi. Why? Well, because... <laughs> That's I so <laughs> random. <laughs> Because I, I said that uh, Shelter is like the Green Goblin. Yeah. Right? He goes from Shelter to the Scrim Reaper. Mm -hmm. And Typical, for some reason, thought that Willem Dafoe played Green Goblin. He does. I mean, no. Steve Buscemi played Green Goblin. Okay. And I was like, no, that's Willem Dafoe. And so we've just decided that Raven King is Steve Buscemi. Sure, man. You know how it is. I I actually don't, <laughs> but what I do know is Smash Bros. I barely know that. Yeah, true. And um, we're uh, yeah. I mean, Ice Knight is pretty commandingly out in front here. Oh yeah, very high in the lead here. Uh, no Arsen on deck anymore. Uh, it really looked like Raven King wasn't able to really capitalize on Arsene. Mm -hmm. uh, good, uh, Ice Knight doing a really good job kind of rushing him down, staying in his face, not letting him get that kind of patented kill power that he's known for. And let's see, what's the uh, light drop? But I mean, Raven King is also just one of those players who is super slippery. I mm -hmm. mean, we talk about Greninja being kind of hard to catch, right? But I mean, it feels like Raven King's signature as a player is being so hard to pin down. I mean, look at him, 145%, half a meter on deck, and you know, he hasn't oh, been that able to- would have been a really gross Ooh. conversion. Yeah. Uh, uh, Ice Knight hasn't been able to really pull off anything there and gets and reversed. Then, and there we go. He just sneaks in that that cheeky little back air, and all of a sudden, Raven King's in the lead and in a pretty good advantage state here. Yeah, I mean, what is uh, Ice Knight's option here? He's kind of kind of looks a little lost or answers, kind of tossing out moves here and there. But I mean, he has to be careful because if he wants, if he doesn't want to get absolutely robbed right now, he needs to take the stock right now because. Arsene is almost on deck, and that's an even harder battle to fight for. Right? Exactly. And as I say that, look, here it is. is. Dude, that is just so tense. I yeah, both players really feeling each other out there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, first hit of back air, not going to do it. As um, And there we go. Short hop uh, forward air. Yeah, really good stuff. But, um, you know, 66%, and he's going, by the time that Arsene comes back, Ice Knight is going to be in kill percent. Yeah, that's the that's the hard part, right? And all this damage tacking onto him, uh, Ice Knight really has to take a ooh, really good run up there, kind of keeping, a, keeping him scared there. Arsene on deck. Yeah, 82, but I mean, it's a lot closer now. Ooh, <laughs> oh. down combo of his own. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, really good stuff from Ice Knight, stealing that stock away before Arsene could become a big problem, but Raven King Let's on the edge there. Let's see what he can do about it. Goes with the high recovery and won't get hit with that, um, the funky little back air. But Arsene is up 109%. Yeah. There's the Nair into the back air. air. And now you're All at 0% right. against Arsene. And this is, I mean, and not a place look at that, now the game's even all. again. <laughs> yeah. Uncharacteristic counter coming out from Raven King there. Mm -hmm. Playing a little nervous here. Arsene offline. Ice Knight looking pretty decent there. That E Hot attack, uh, attack on a little bit more damage. What? Oh, what? Huh? I'm huh? sorry. What? <laughs> just what went, the? just went bah! with uh, the little what? <laughs> grappling hook and just sent him off the top. Uh, really good stuff from Raven King. That just was that was silly. Stealing that stock away. That I was, was so silly. I was giving Ice Knight props there, and then Raven King's like, no, 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 no. I'm winning here. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's a not in my house. <laughs> but, I mean, I mean, yeah, if you think about it, you know, Scrims is kind of where 
Raven King really resides a lot, right? I mean, mm -hmm. we see him all over the place in Chicago. But, I mean... Oh, that's... That's Okay, okay, okay. He's, he's back. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Greninja is broken. But, uh, yeah, it's an Ice Knight, not really a big, um, a big scrims commoner, right? So, I mean, right. we really do have, you know, uh, Raven King, kind of the king of the castle here, uh, kind of defending us from a little bit of inva invasion from uh, Ice Knight. Oh, they're going so low. Is that... Oh, yeah, no, it's Joker. He's fine. But Joker doesn't have a side. jump now. Okay, yeah. he's back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, both... Oh, with the jab the block, jab that's block. so yeah. unfortunate. But let's see uh, what he can do here. Our no longer online, so no longer a problem. Uh, making it a little bit easier to kind of uh, pin down uh, Joker here. Mm -hmm. But even so, I mean, we've said it, I said it before, uh, Raven King, really, really slippery player. Uh, not, not too easily killed. All right. I mean... So, we've commented Raven King a lot. Yeah. And we've always... Ooh. That was a cheeky down there. Yeah. We've always, like, spoken about how good his his ledge trapping is. And yeah, his yeah. edge guarding. But I think Ice Knight has been doing a really good job of not letting that happen. Yeah, no. He's been, like, you know, choosing the correct ledge option a lot. Super calm, um, super collected on the ledge. Yeah, not letting uh, Raven King. I think King he just did five dash attacks. He went dash attack, dash attack, dash attack, and then turned around and did like two more. Raven King or? Uh, uh, Ice Knight. Ice Knight, yeah. Raven King is still the same thing. <laughs> Raven King loves dash attack. We love burst options on our rush down characters. Yep. But uh, let's see. Raven King in a good spot here, only 15% on him, but even as I say that, you know, we've got Ice Knight now on the ledge trap. Really good stuff from Ice Knight. Good combo. Yeah, but giving him Arsene with it, right? And yeah. now uh, you've got to take the stock fast, right? Because mm -hmm. you do not want to uh, be in that situation. Oh, Unfortunate upbeat, oh. but Greninja sucks, and he falls it's out so of the true. up smash. Both these characters are, um, they're not like, I don't know where I was going with that. I, I, no, I, just I genuinely had something and then I just what totally the lost it. What? 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 Huh? Bro. This, scrims everybody, come to scrims where you can see funny things like this. Maybe he really is a phantom thief. Yeah, he's been he, stealing that was, these that stocks. That is another stock that he just robbed <laughs> so early, dude. Really good grapple uh, from Raven King, and all of a sudden turning a situation where he was down to a situation where he is up two stocks, and he's mm -hmm. got um, Ice Knight at a pretty decent percentage. That fourth throw going to take the stock for Ice Knight, but what can he do here? Really good jab uh, coming out. All right, 48 to 84. Uh, Raven King kind of on the back foot here, even though he's up in percent. But um, Arsene's here, but he has to kind of be on the stage to use it effectively. Yeah. So, um, oh, and let's go. Up smash on Greninja sucks. It's so yep. bad. His most, uh, his best kill move, by the way. Unusable. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, forward, forward tilt? tilt? Yep. Yeah, that's going to take it. Good stuff right. to Ice Knight. All right, they're laughing it off. Yeah, yeah, that yeah. was, yeah. yeah. Running it back, I think. Yeah, it looks like it. Really good stuff Smash to Smash a classic, baby. Yeah, yeah, really good stuff to Ice Knight, though. Uh, kind of taking that. Uh, not losing his composure when he got absolutely gimped off mm -hmm. stage with the guns. Um, so I guess up to him not letting that uh, shake him too much. Yeah. I have been on the receiving end of Joker down gun way too many times. Yeah, you, just, you just take it. It's like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> but running it straight back. Um, a much more competitive game here. Uh, going into game number three. All right. Let's see how they uh, open up here because, you know, Game three, they've kind of been feeling each other out a little bit. Hopefully, right, right. Uh, you know, get some of the habits down, understand what you can punish and, like, yeah. the the different openings you can get in. And, uh, yeah, much more even start here. 
as they're just kind of jockeying for position here at center stage. Yeah, really uh, super even for Suns, although we'll see how really good jab block into the forward smash. Ice Knight gonna take the lead right away. Oh yeah. Up a good amount here, just sort of empty hopping, and he's gonna get in there. Empty hops are so scary. Yeah, these two, I mean, these two players make them scary, right? Yeah. I mean, empty hops can only take you so far, but knowing that this, uh, the player, the person you're fighting, Raven King or Ice Knight, it has so much behind it, right? So much mm -hmm. presence, so much power. And it's a really good, really good options from both of them. Oh, raw, see, see the empty hop and then just the raw F smash if he <laughs> wasn't ready for His it. His shield, uh, Ice Knight's shield is so low at this point, or was so low at that point. Yeah. Not gonna get the F smash. But Ooh, good drag, drag down. down. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, and yes. So. Really good catch there. Way deep down there with the back air. Um, you know, down 100%, but, you know, we've seen Raven King win these and we've seen him lose these. So it's still anyone's game. And he just did it right back to him. Yeah, really good. Waited, he waited out the counter and hit him and hit him right hit him for with it. the back air. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ice Knight, uh, really considerable lead right now, right? He's got mm -hmm. an up full two stock. stock. Yeah, a full stock, only 1% online. Uh, you know, Red King kind of have to pull something out of his back pocket here if he really wants to take this uh, the game. And we kind of saw this in the Shelter set, or at least I did. I don't know if you watched it. Because Shelter won the first two games pretty cleanly, pretty right, right, right. Uh, demandingly. And then Ice Knight brought it back for the reverse 3-0. And it's kind of what we're seeing here. Raven King won that first game. Yeah, that was kind of nasty. The Hydro Pump to push him just barely away from the ledge so he couldn't grab it on the way up. And then forward smashing his uh, end lag on it. Really good stuff from Ice Knight. Yeah. And just like that, Ice Knight's up 2-1. Yeah. And that's something that, like, somebody who, like, knows their character inside and out, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, I, who goes for that? <laughs> Ice Knight up here, and he goes for that. Right? I mean, that's crazy. Raven King's got his favorite song on. Oh, yeah. Everything. And uh, we're going back to Smattlefield, I think. Three, Small Battlefield, two, yeah. yeah. This is kind of like the Raven King theme song. He mm -hmm. really likes the song. Uh, let's see if it is enough to oh, give him the power. They're so slippery. Yeah, both these players are really good. And it's like a lot of the time, the two of them can't like get like the full combos they're kind of known for, right? Mm -hmm. It's like they get two, three hits in here, another two hits there. Uh, both players doing a really good job just being evasive. Yeah, you know, playing neutral in my children's fighting game? Nah. How dare you? Yeah. <laughs> but there's a dash attack. I just realized that. Uh, Dash attack and forward air on Joker are the exact same animation. I mean, kinda. They're just a, they're both just a double kick. I mean, yeah, it was the same same one. But it's not the same animation. It might as well be. That's okay. Ooh, really good two frame on the down tilt. Everything doing a good job, not letting it phase in. Doing a really good job, just kind of evading. And something I've noticed is that as he steals the stock, I was going to say something I noticed that is Ice Knight is not letting uh, Joke, uh, Raven King play around with Arsene too, too much. He's doing a really good job of just not yeah. letting it phase him, not letting that Arsene kill tower really affect him too much, taking, going all the way out there for the edge guard. Oh yeah, he went way out there and it paid off. So they're totally different animations, dude. No, they're not. It's just, a, it's a double kick. That's the only thing that's the same. No, the same animation. I don't it's care. I don't care if I'm right or wrong. I'm just, uh, I refuse Steve, to be wrong. Steve forward air and Steve dash attack. It's the same animation. No, because Steve forward air is only the pickaxe swing. Yeah. Steve dash attack, he's running forward. Okay, same with the same no, with, uh, not same the with same Joker. At all. Not he's same running at all. forward and doing a double kick, and then he's doing a double kick in the air. No. There's... Anyway, so the game, because I, you're, you're stubborn. <laughs> you're stubborn, and you won't let me have this. So no, we're going to talk about not. the game now. Uh, but uh, I'm so sorry, Ice Knight or Raven King, if you're, like, trying to do some serious, like, body <laughs> viewing after this, and then you have to listen to us. <laughs> <laughs> this is not me in typical, right? Yeah. Or typical shelter. That's an awful commentary. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> uh, but uh, both. 
Ice All Knight, right. 33% on Ice Knight right now. Uh, let's see if either person can really uh, steal out of stock here, because that's going to be super important to the um, He went tight right game. in the face as he came yeah, down. Yeah. 155, he's hanging on for entirely too long yeah. as he takes an Eha to the face. Both characters can really kind of take a stock here, right? And it's yeah. like, it's super important. This stock right here is going to turn the tide of essentially the set, and Ice Knight is going to take it at 168% max rage, so let's see what mm -hmm. else he can He's, do. He here. needs the stock right now. Yes. The next the next move that Raven King connects, there we go. There is. I'm so proud, he listened to me. <laughs> and uh, nice. even 0-0, zero, zero. he's got about a third of a meter. Yeah. Uh, let's see how quickly he can charge it back, misses the re-grab, and is gonna get hit by that up smash. Yeah, that Nair beating out the Aha, not letting, uh, not tacking on that, a bunch of that extra damage. Arsene is out, really good two frame from Ice Knight. This is looking like a bad situation to be in if Ooh. your Raven King really bad Another counter. kind of missed counter. Yeah. And Raven King doesn't miss counters, so. Yeah. Ooh. Solid back air there. Arsene on deck, all of a sudden the stocks, are, uh, the percentage Ooh. is super close. That super uh, Shuriken turned him around. Which, which was probably really important because he was Ooh. fishing for that back air. And, uh, cool. Oh, that was such a smart tech roll. Miss the, miss the drag the down. It's gonna pay the price for it. Oh, wanted the ledge slip, but he gets the back air and it will kill. Ooh, Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to a game five. I mean, really good stuff to Raven King. I mean, really kind of skimming his teeth on that one. Oh, yeah. I mean, all of a sudden, kind of tapping into something there and just, like, not letting Ice Knight breathe for a solid, like, 10, 15 seconds there. Mm -hmm. And using that to that, that kind of smothering oppression to just kind of really beat him out. You said um, tapped in there. And I was going to make a reference about how Joker taps into the metaverse. And then I was like, wait, that's not the name of wherever they go. You know what? You could have said that because I've never touched a Persona game yeah. before. And I wouldn't have known any different. It's... it's I, for, I forget what it's called. I've played Persona 5, and I've played Strikers. Strikers is better, and, you know, you're, you're just going to have to fight me on that one. But... It doesn't matter, because the game sucks regardless. You I've know never what? touched it, but that's it again sucks. That's, that's certainly an opinion of all time. <laughs> that's how I feel about Xenoblade. This game sucks. Yeah, Xenoblade sucks. I'll give you that. Xenoblade, I've never touched a Xenoblade in the game before, but those games suck. Mm -hmm. I've seen what you guys have been playing with Xenoblade 2. Y'all not fooling me. <laughs> <laughs> dude, I can't wait to see the comment section on this set, dude. Comments are going to hate me. Uh, but good stuff to Ice Knight taking that stock yep. uh, before Raven King. Uh, let's see, how much extra credit can he get on, or is Raven King going to kind of fire back? And it's not looking like he's going to, because he's at the ledge and unable mm -hmm. to move. Good up. Ooh, misses the down smash there. Could have yeah. had something kind of sick. But, um, yeah. He's, uh, Ice Knight's a full stock up at this point. Yeah. And it's, he's looking fairly commanding. Yeah. You know, he's not letting Raven King play his own game. No. You know, he's forcing Raven King to, like, play around him. And as, like, a, you know, such an aggressive rushdown character, that's exactly what you want to do. No, of course. And it's not looking good here. Uh, Raven King at 135%. Ooh, that back here, back not going to take it. Fish. That one's going to take another it, one, and I he's going to get it. He's at a really bad deficit here. 135% uh, against a fresh second stock. Ooh, but, but he's, he's cooking. He's Let him cook. To his, to his advantage, 33%. Really going for it. Oh, weeding it all with that you know forward what? smash. You gotta pay the I price. respect it. I respect that forward smash. Yeah, when you're down that low, I mean, you kind of have to go for mm. that, you know? And that probably would have taken the stock, to be honest. Uh, did he have Arsene? Yes. Okay. Th yeah, probably. Arsene, max rage, yes. But really good stuff. Let's What's see. What's he gonna Let's do? Roll? Oh, that would have been really cool if I called it. <laughs> Like not letting Ooh, good wait out on the air dodge. Gonna take another one. Our but gets our on send, deck, that's and that's really, uh, what a way to go. Yeah. Well, Ice Knight gets revenge in the run back, yeah. and um, uh, he's gonna be meeting a Tata here in Grants. 
grand finals, Ateta versus Ice Knight. Really good stuff to both players here, though. I mean, mm -hmm. putting on a show, going to five, uh, 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 game five, right? That was a real good set. Oh, that was a really good set. So, how many more fan bases do you think we can get mad before Atata and Ice Knight come back? Uh, do we want to go down the list? I mean, um... Yeah, go for it. Um, let's see. Uh, Fire Emblem games are boring and True. stupid. Um, well, I wouldn't say stupid. I no, they're, say they're they're boring. boring and stupid. It's just anime chess, and I don't want to watch it. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to watch an episode of an anime that I don't. I don't like. <laughs> just to play chess, okay? I have to be in a specific mood to play chess, and I don't want to watch an episode of an anime before I do it. Oh my god! How could so you say something so con controversial yet so brave? <laughs> I'm right. Are you <laughs> kidding me? That's that's all it is. Oh my god, dude. Uh, let's see. Who else can I get up? So I don't know. I I, I don't think I I have a lot of very specific takes, but I don't think any of them are all that great. Yeah. Nothing that's gonna upset people. Well, then let me hear some of your takes. We've got some time. Uh. I'm trying to think here. Just, just give me a take. It doesn't, a take? It, it doesn't matter. Just give me a take. A take. Uh, we could go Star Wars. Okay. The Last Jedi is one of the best Star Wars movies, period. See, you said one of the best. So I'm, Top I'm three. willing to... Top three, and okay, it's so not number two. It's not number two or number three. You, you think Last Jedi is the best Star Wars movie? Period, yes. That's bold. I know it is. That's an ex I, I want to say you're wrong, but I am. Okay, so. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you sit there yeah. with your arms crossed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think the, um, the top. Three I'm I'm episode six pilled. I'm Return of the Jedi. Pilled. Return of the Jedi is also really good. I like Return of the Jedi a lot. Definitely, like I, I would put I would put my order probably. If I'm putting personal biases aside, yes. right, I I'll be fair and put my personal biases aside. Okay, it's a new hope. New a new hope is boring. Uh, no, oh my, what are you talking new about? New hope is boring. A new hope is iconic. Yeah, it's iconic. iconic. It is. It is a perfect movie. A perfect movie. Yes, because it is. It follows the formula perfectly. And yes. It is boring. No, what are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about. It's crazy. It's okay. Rogue One is the best Star Wars movie. That's fine. That's, That's just objectively incorrect. Are you... T objectively... That movie is carried by the last act. Ex so? Hard carried by that last act being some of the best, like, phenomenal. And then on top of that, the Vader scene afterwards. Yeah. It is carried by that. The, you have to sleep through the rest of the movie to get to the exciting part. I didn't realize I was still Excelsior alive. Excelsior discovers what a slow burn is in real time. That's not a slow burn. You know what's a slow burn? Andor is a slow burn. Andor is also peak Star Wars. Andor is peak Star Wars. Andor Rogue is One peak. is not. Rogue One is not peak Star Wars. It's yeah. okay. It's not terrible. I, yeah. don't get me wrong. It's not bad. It's like... Um, Rogue One is the perfect example of a movie that didn't need to happen, but I'm so glad that it did. If I pretend that Rogue One is just that last act, yeah. perfect movie. Yeah. If I ignore everything else about it, which makes it not good. Okay, so we're back into the game. So we can <laughs> we can, we can talk we can stop talking about Star Wars now, and uh, we can talk about Super Smash Brothers Ultimate for the Nintendo Switch. Yeah, Ice Knight versus Tata. I think uh, we're sitting in grand finals here. Ice yep. Knight coming up from loser's side, and uh, it's not looking good, man. <laughs> yeah, uh, I was I was gonna make him uh, something about how you know Ice Knight has just played two really hard fought sets, and he's warm, and Atata's been kind of sitting. Uh, but, but that doesn't really matter to Atata. Yeah. <laughs> no, Atata icing. You know, who who's that? Never heard of him. I mean, he's still only taking fifteen percent. Like, bro is let let him cook. I, I mean, look. Here's the other thing too. Atata is kind of on a win streak when it comes to scrims. I think he, if I'm not mistaken, has won every scrim he's entered <laughs> for for this season. Yeah. He's uh going real. He is taking 27%. <laughs> bro, what? 
let's see what Ice Knight can do to fire back here. He's going to have to do something here because, I mean, that's 33% uh, uh, across two stocks now. Yeah. And uh, Atata just really looking to propose to just kind of take this game one. So is S semicolon G, is that a Steins Gate reference, you think? I have no idea. Like an anime reference? I have no, last last time me and uh, me and Typical were on a Spider-Man kick and I just said it was called it, it stands for Spider Guy. Yeah. Yeah. That's so fair. That's where I'm sitting with those. Uh, and until I think until Yami is a, a black clover reference, which is bro, mid anime. I don't, by I don't the watch way. anime, bro. <laughs> I don't either. We were just we were just going over this. I'm just we like really dodge. tangentially uh, involved, good air dodge. but yeah. All right. Oh, third good air dodge. Oh, d double tech. Oh, triple, triple tech. tech. And he gets the. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. Really good stuff from Ice Knight. Okay. Showing signs of life in this game number one here. Let's see where, where else he can. Crazy. Yeah. Let's see where else he can take this. I mean, jeez. Yeah. You know, he's definitely not going to just lay down and uh, let Atata run over him. No, not at all. He has a long way to go still in yeah, this game. Yeah, it's a, it's a big climb on the mountain here. Let's see if Ice Knight has what it takes to take it. And, I mean, he's doing a good job kind of really playing just outside of Atata's range, right? And doing the drag down there. Good, good Really good damage. up air string. Ooh, really good air dodge there from uh, Atata. Misses the drag down. All right. <laughs> I didn't even see that come out. I just, I just saw the, the up smash just rock. Why are characters who use yo-yos in fighting games always just like, um, just menaces? I don't know. I, what is it about a yo-yo that is so? Because well, you got like, you got Ness and you got Bridget. They're just I don't want to talk about Bridget. I don't want to talk about Bridget. <laughs> Heading into game number two here. Let's see uh, what's going on here. All right. Let's see if Ice Knight can, you know, bounce back from that one. Because uh, as we say in the business, that was rough. Yeah. I mean, he showed signs of life there towards the end of it. Mm -hmm. But, like, not a good first game to kind of have there. Especially when you just got off the heels of two really good sets, right? Mm -hmm. You're playing super hot. So let's see if he can take it further here. But uh, Atata is not a player that, you know, lets stuff like that affect him easily, you know? Yeah. And, uh, but 72% on him here. Mm -hmm. Let's see who can take this stop first. Yeah. Both these uh, very volatile characters. Uh, they can, you know, do a lot of damage really quickly. They can uh, secure kills really quickly. So the difference here, though, is that um, Ness's moves work. Yes. And um, Greninja's don't ever. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we saw in the last few games. Yeah, Raven King was falling out of up smash after up smash. I uh, smash after up smash, dude. I've I played Aster and have fallen out of back airs because those moves just it, the, it just multi this game are not good. But um, really good stuff. Ooh. Securing that stock, really good stuff to Atata, taking that stock, 90% on him. Let's see what... Uh, Ooh, read the roll, but whiffs the, the follow-up. Yeah, not fast enough on the, on the follow-up, but he is going to take that up smash. This is looking a lot better than the last game. Really coming alive here. Let's see where else uh, I can take this. Ooh, he's cooking, 54%. Atata is so scary, dude. Like, yeah. e every it, it feels like mashing almost. I mean, mm -hmm. that's what Ness just looks like, period. But, <laughs> I mean, Atata... Mashing with a purpose. Yeah, that's what Atata is doing. He, like, is genuinely... It feels like he's always somewhere, right? Right. Really oh, good. That was with so the, good. With the tail of the PK Thunder into the up air. Atata looking, uh, looking pretty... Pretty good on this second stock here. Let's see where else he can take it. But Ice Knight not too happy about that. Firing back 50%, 60. Let's see where else he can go with it. Ooh. Oh, Ooh. Is it? oh, he saved that. That was kind of clean. Jeez, the drift on that was crazy. All right. Uh, Hydro Pump, you know, doesn't even matter. Yeah, he did not care about that. Oh. Okay. Oh my god, dude. Oh, that was gross. Let him play the game. <laughs> Atata. Mean mugging it too. 
Yeah. Really good stuff. Hey, he deserves a good mean mug after that. That was kind of gross. I mean, it, we, we were talking about how Ice Knight was doing a pretty good job. Much better than the game one. Mm -hmm. And then Atata was just like, eh, actually, I survived this. That should have 100% killed me. Mm -hmm. Let me now win the game off of it. Yeah. <laughs> Going into game number three, um, Ice Knight not looking good. Yeah, Those this might be a, a real quick... <laughs> I don't know why that was so funny <laughs> with the, the sound effects of just the bong. <laughs> the Nessus forward smash has such good sound design, and I, I don't know I, I don't know why it makes that sound when sending back a water shuriken. But um, even though time. he he got that really good uh I don't even want to say really good just that really weird read right at the uh -huh. beginning. And uh, Ice Knight has, from that point, kind of put a lot of a lot of pressure on him. Although we see here as he a tad of fire is back. Living. Yeah. This is not good looking yet. No, that time yeah. he's gonna take it. All right. Ooh. He's trying to catch him, and he's that gonna catch him gonna work. this time. He missed an up smash on the other platform earlier, and um, got it this time. So really good stuff. Uh, even stocks on the tools, and let's see where we can go from here. Yep. I, I believe. I believe. You believe? I, I, I believe. I, Ice Knight's not usually the type of guy to get shaken. Uh, but we'll we'll see. You know, he's in. He's currently in the lead. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, we'll see. These these magnets sort of just gliding. And yeah. he's he's coming. He's still in it. Yeah, he's not really looking alive. This game number three. Uh, he's got Atata kind of on the ropes here. Uh, oh, hit him with it again. Really okay, good. Okay, okay. Really good stuff. Get out, out of, of it. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now both real players. Atata's gonna take that stock first, but I mean, not a bad position to be in if you're. Oh my! What? Dude, what? I I looked away for for literally one second. Atata, what is wrong with you? Why did you do that? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for coming to Scrims. <laughs> Good stuff. That'll to do it. Uh, Congratulations, Atata, for that. That he was at clean. seventeen <laughs> after the hit. After the hit, he was at seventeen. <laughs> yeah. Bro, what, dude? Uh. Yeah. Um, yeah. Thanks, everyone. <laughs> thanks for coming. Uh, make sure to like, follow, and subscribe. VG yeah. Bootcamp. I say it every single time. VG Bootcamp really holding it down for so many years at this point. Um, if you've got that Prime, go ahead and toss it to it, or you know that four ninety nine a month, and get all these cool looking emotes. Look at these. Yeah, look at those. Look at the jab lock emote. Yeah. And, anyway, uh, I'm Icarus. I'm Excelsior, and we'll see you guys next week. You guys have a nice night. <laughs> More like have an ice night. <laughs> Thank you.